Hey guys, what's up? I am here. We are here. I'm gonna take care of some things as I set up the stream. I gotta email some people. I gotta put cards away. I gotta talk to the viewers. We gotta update y'all about, about mats. I opened an Elite Trainer Box today and that was kinda wild. And um, yeah, we got some updates for your face. For a couple of you, Devin's already here with the swiftness. <clears throat> What's up, Dev? Everybody should wish Devin a happy birthday. I'm gonna do that later as the stream goes on. Uh, make sure that everybody can see everything. Okay. Mr. Face, struggle with depression. All right, Mr. Face. <laughs> hey, and night goes with the first like We're at four likes already. That's, that's kind of wild, I'm not gonna lie. All right, let me put in this tracking number for my people that are supposed to send me a box. Just give me one second, guys. Uh, if I can find my tracking number, I don't know where the tracking number is. For one price, here it is. Sixty-four dollars to send all this garbage. Uh, what is the tracking number? He used to send us this. Um, can I reply? Is there like just reply? Can I just reply? And let's see. What an absurdly, these tracking numbers are absurdly long. Long. Let's do cap sock. <sighs> um, who's here? I love I can give you six more codes. Oh, I pulled a guard. Hey, that's my boy. Guard of Let's see. Uh, 16V. 0360. Seven zero. Give me one second, guys. Nine three zero. Three eight two. Okay, let's send this. So that's out of the way. Hope I can get my card sooner rather than later. <clears throat> Dang, was hoping to be the first leg. Hey, but Ty, we appreciate you. We all appreciate you here at Orbomb Industries. Is it sent correctly? Everything's good. We got six likes already with eight people. Hey guys, drop a like if you haven't already, but also, what's poppin'? Thank you guys all so much. How y'all doing today? Yada, yada, yada. Um, let's do send just to make sure it's sent properly. Yes, it did. Perfect. Now we gotta check Gmail because the guy who I talked to about doing those mats has agreed to, has agreed to it. So at this point, he's currently moving. So hopefully he doesn't flake on me like every other artist does. But I told him I do want to work with him. I really enjoy his artwork and I would love to get this done. So he told me um, he's in the process of moving into an apartment. So once he gets his Wi-Fi and everything set up, he could start drawing again. Are you ready for tomorrow? Dude, I am set for tomorrow. Thank shout outs to Devin for giving me a bunch of codes. I owe him I owe him all the codes plus some. But he gave it to me so we could have all the openings ready because I'm not gonna get my boxes in time. I'm getting one of my boxes next week. Uh, oh, speaking of which, that's another thing I have to do real quick. <clears throat> but, and also, I should probably tell people that I'm streaming, huh? Go on Discord real quick. Live. Boom. Let's do. We are Live and ready. Tweet this. Well, uh, Sarge, I just got my first two boxes this morning. Hey, how'd they go? Choose your box. I'll be shipping out by the end of the week. Okay, so I'm not going to get them at the end of the week. I'll get them at next week. Zoinks, you've taken a wrong turn. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. Link isn't working for me. Well, uh... To me, yo, what up, Orbum? I got lots of burning shadows packed open on TOG on release day. Oh, TCGO. Tomorrow? Hey, that's my boys. We might have an early stream, guys, by the way. Because I might want to open them on release time. Um, because I want to be able to build decks the same day on stream. And then record as well. So we'll see about that. 
But for those of you guys who don't know, I'm gonna put this on stream for people that don't know, so that people that watch this later will know for the future. But here's an example of this dude's artwork that I really like, who's gonna be making our mats. Um, there it is. This is his. Uh, this is one of his mat designs. I really like his style. Let me see if I can find more of his style. No, but I like his style of artwork. Uh, he also made this. I love this Typhlosion art. Um, this is one of my favorites that he's done. But like, he has a really good style, and that's the thing that I, it's hard to find Pokemon artists that have good style. So um, I was really excited about this. So I told him to make a, T a, a Togekiss and Kario one, and just work from there. And he said fine, and it's gonna cost me eighty dollars. But thanks to you guys, all of y'all's generous donations, we should have enough um, for the for the mats. He has a lot of other examples too, but uh, I don't feel like going into it right now. But you guys can look them up. I think that's what Jax for the next season. Hey, or are you ready for tomorrow? Hey, I'm trying to learn JavaScript right now before school starts. Hey, good luck with that. Stab it to a Slim Jim. Oh, yeah. What's up, Champion Orange? I've been playing really hard. I have 25 packs online. Can't wait. Hey, it's my boy. I have to drive an hour for the closest place that sells cards, and it's only a Walmart, so hopefully they'll have some Friday. Oh, yeah. I think you have to call them first, Ty, so you don't waste the drive. What's up, Noah? Full Art Rescue and that Secret Fire Energy. Yo, Sarge, I want that Full Art Rescue, bro. <laughs> yeah, the mat's sweet, right? Cool dibs on the first ba batch with your new cards. Oh yeah, is all going to be anywhere in the mat like logo or something? Probably. I'm not too sure. I could put like a small like ore bomb on the bottom. Just the text that says ore bomb. I can do that maybe in post. We'll see. Hmm. Sorry, my family's yelling right now. So I'm just trying to hear to make sure they ain't talking to me. Mm. Oh, battle? Oh, battle, I see. B E T T. It was on the first battle with <laughs> the new cards. Hey, whenever I go on uh, Discord, I'll just be asking for random challenges for post rotation. So be on the lookout for that. Streaming too? Dope. That is, what's his name, I guess. I need to draw like that. Yeah, I'm definitely going to call. Sucks being closer to Mexico than the town, <laughs> pretty much. I'm sorry, Ty. Man, hopefully you're in the area soon so that we can so we can hit it up. But also, I got an elite trainer box today, guys. And if you guys go to my Instagram, you can see what I pulled. It's kind of wild. It was the first time I've ever got three hits in one elite trainer box. We got Tapu Fini GX, just regular Tapu Fini. We got a full art Necrozma GX. And we finish it off with a lovely, hyper rare Gardevoir GX, guys. Which is really good because that's like the third or second most expensive card in the set. And to me, I, I just want to pull all the most expensive cards because that way I don't have to buy them later to finish the master set. So that was extremely hype for me. Oh, what's up, Nyx and Gyro? How y'all doing? Oh yeah, I remember. I was wondering what was happening. Um, but I have to put these cards away in my master set binder. So before we start officially the stream, we're just kind of hanging out and talking. So. Leave me some questions if you guys have any questions. Or we just kind of relax a little bit. I also decided that I feel like Metagross is going to be good enough to warrant putting in my play binder. Uh, the only thing that sucks about that is I, I don't have a lot of... <laughs> I have I only have uh, regular art, full art, and hyper rare Metagross. Which, when it comes to decks that I like, but I'm, not, I'm never going to like... Uh, sorry about all the noise. I'm never going to play super competitively. I'd rather have... Um, the minimum rarity, but that's fine, whatever. I'll just have to treat them with extra care. But, ah, uh, Elite Trainer Box. I love this Necrozma one. I love the dice in it. The Hyper Rare Charizard is the most expensive card in the set. Yeah, but the thing is, I don't know if it's a, I don't know if Gardevoir or, or Guzma is more expensive right now. The port would be better in Burning Shadows than Sun and Moon. Then Sun and Moon base, I'm not too sure, but probably better than Guardians Rising. Guardians Rising had a really low pull rate. It's super duper low pull rate. It's really upsetting. What kind of? I have plenty of those. And this is. I have plenty of that. I think. I hope. I think it was breakthrough. I guess let's check later. 
trying to put away some cards right now, guys. Um, Guardian is so hype, exactly. What's up, Frank, uh, Franco and Gengar Sightings? Nice to see both of you. Always appreciate it when you guys come to the stream. Um, I'll put these up here. I'll put this up here. Okay. Where is my ETB? There it is. I gotta get my play binder, my master set binder, my hyper rare binder. All these different binders. It's my trade binder. By the way, guys, since you're all here, go ahead and drop a like. It is always greatly appreciated. Patrick's not here yet. None of the uh, usual people are here. Patrick and Nebby and them. That's strange. Can I, can I, can't be a stream tonight, Peppy? I have a test in the morning. Oh, okay, so that's why Nebby can't be here. Oh, yeah, and Ty, thank you, Ty, for telling me about those Eclipse leaves that are really good, because I was thinking about getting them, because they don't have, they have matte on the inside, so they don't glare, so it's really good for videos. So thank you for letting me know that they're worth getting. All right, I have to shuffle those, put those away. This is my bulk. I need a place to put all my bulk. Actually, I don't really need a place to put all my bulk. I can just get rid of it, to be honest. This is a Waltz Reverse I can get rid of. The energies I can just trash somewhere. Ooh, why is there a Bridget here? That is a good card to have on hand. On hand. Sycamore as well. Another Reverse Waltz. I don't know why those are in there. Money, dude. Money is here. We about that money. Money. Yeah, yeah. That money. Money. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> What's poppin' bruh? Nice to see you. Thank you for joining the stream. Yeah, we'll put that with bulk. We'll put these with energies. We have the necrosma sleeves. I like the necrosma sleeves, but I'm never gonna use them. I never really use these sleeves that they give us. I kind of collect them, kind of, I guess. I don't really know how I'd say it. Uh, but we'll be taking a couple matches today. We're probably gonna play some Legacy as well. Uh, actually, speaking of Legacy, let me take a look at what I have as far as Legacy decks go. Um, oh, and I have to talk about one more thing. What is the card you're looking forward to from Burning Shadows? I want as many Guzmas as possible because they're hard to get. <laughs> That's the only reason. I want three of them for decks, but I want to get as many as possible because I can sell them. They're the most sellable card. I want one Hyper Ray Charizard just to finish the Master Set, but Guzma's definitely up there for me. Uh, I want Gliss Pods because I really like the Gliss Pod deck. Let me go... What is the going to be the best deck for Worlds? Dude, I don't know. It's hard to tell. Um, I think Volcanian is just super duper decent. So I'd say like off the top of my head, off the top of my head, Volcanian. <clears throat> hmm. All right, guys, I'm going to be playing some Legacy today. If, there, if there's any Legacy decks you're interested in me building, let me know, and I'll look at probably Styx's deck list and go from there. Pretty much. We're gonna start with Lando Mewtwo. Just because it's fighting, I need to finish my light fight, fighting thing anyways. Just drop by to say hi, have algebra test in 13 hours, filling in the map days later. Alright, bro. Or really quick. Um that I'm going to do it. I'm going to follow through with that guy, Nebby. I guess that's what I should say. Taking a b talk about money, I can donate on Friday. I figured out how to donate. I really want I really like an acerola. I really would like an acerola. I just donated. You spell this out now. I C U P. Cool. These donation perks, oh yeah, I gotta talk about the donation perks. First of all, thank you, Mr. Friday. Let me actually add $2 to your uh, to the giveaway thing. So you guys already know, we have those monthly giveaways, right? Um, Friday. Oh, I forgot this shows on screen. Friday, two. So you guys already know, the end of the month, uh, for every dollar you donate, you have a chance of winning a card that's in our monthly giveaway tabs on our Discord. Uh, this month it is a full art top of Lele GX and an Seeker Air Enhanced Hammer on PCGO. Well, I figured that there's a lot of people. <laughs> Pat, Nico Nico, um, Champion Orange, <laughs> Nebby, Ty. Like, there's a lot of people that donate a lot to me, all right? And I there's only one winner a month. So I figured I have a new way to help other people get things, even though they don't win the cards in case they don't win them you know what i mean um and that way is going to be um let me do this first because i'm not gonna be able to focus and that way is going to be 
signed cards from me. I know it's nothing extra extravagant, but I figured I'm gonna give top three, and if there's a lot of donators that month, top five donators, a signed card of whatever they want from me. I have a stack of Riolus, Lucarios, Tokepi, Tokekiss, Tokatix, and just a bunch of other commons, uncommons, and non holo rares are sitting around in the house. And I'd be gladly willing to send you whatever cards you want. Uh, I know a lot of people want my signed cards, but I haven't had a chance to like, or like I haven't been given the opportunity to to not sell, to do that for people. Cause it used to be a big thing I did back when I was a smaller channel. But now I figured it's a perfect opportunity for me to have, to, for me to do that. Cause you know, I, I don't know. That was the only thing that came to mind, to be honest. It kind of feels lame, but I want to do as much as I can for the viewers <laughs> for, for helping me out so much. You son of a gun. I recently made a deck that beats every deck 80% of the time. 50-50 and a 50-50 Green Ninja. Tell me what it is, Trey. Uh, we'll see at Worlds. The last two years have been unexpected winners pretty much. Yo, I'm so hyped when the Guardians all so happy I pulled one off with the pre-release. Hey, that's dope money. Sweet, I choose a full art Mallow. All right, well, the thing is, I could potentially do cards. I would just have to buy them online first. So obviously price is going to be an issue. Um, but if that's what people want, I can do that. <laughs> Nico, make it top five for that for the month, last month. Well, I'm not going to start it till just now. <laughs> so it's going to be at the end of this month. Thank you, you're so cool. Thank you for your generosity. Ah, uh, thanks, Nikos. So I've been solitary, solitary a little in muck. It's not good. Too much relies on release resetting your Pokemon that gives conditions. Deck really needs hyper, hyper hypnotoxic laser to be good in standard. Yeah, I kind of agree with you, Mr. Prada. I've had a lot of success with it because I've been playing it with Po Town. So every time I evolve Salazzle, I can Ace Arola it, which is really, really good. <laughs> but uh, once again, I still think it's like a tier two, like mid tier two deck. Right, I'm gonna start organizing cards. I guess I'll play a game while I do that. I don't have anything else to do, right? I have to put Metagross into the Playbinder, but we have all stream to do that. I'm not in a rush. No. I'm just gonna organize these by type for now, and then do all that stuff later. Plus, it takes me forever to find a game anyways, because, you know, nobody plays Legacy. <laughs> If I do enough, I'll send you a vinyl copy of my two-pack album. Will Cranium sign it? Sure. <laughs> Once again, that's another thing, yeah. You can send me any card you want and I'll sign it and send it back. That's another thing. A any amount of cards too, like, just don't send me like a thousand cards. That'd be unfortunate for me. <laughs> I still don't have a new Ninetales card. I'm pretty sure it's in one of these like deck boxes or something like that, these uh, theme boxes. Uh, it'll be like a hollow one, I believe. So that's pretty nice. I'll probably just do that. Did you know there are no steel type cards in this set? I, I just find that kind of weird. I know I don't need any more of those. Alright, I found a game that's surprising to say the least. I'm in the Cosmic GX deck and oh my god, it beats everything. What is it? Tell me how tell me tell me about its build and I'll judge it and I'll judge you critically. <laughs> Alright, opening hand is kinda of bad. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this actually. I want Trubbish. I want energies as well. I guess I can get Jirachi to get the what's it called? It's like done. Yeah, I'll focus on the game for a bit. Oh wait a minute, he's going first. Never mind. Back to this. Oh we got I got a reverse hall of picks, that's kinda that's kinda cool. Um What's he doing? Sky Arrow Bridge that gives us like less retreat cost, right? The retreat cost each break more one is one less. Alright, dope. Dude, I would love to do a video with you, but I don't know how good my deck is. Money? I mean, you can always challenge me whenever you want. If you want to record it yourself, you can. Uh, I never really mind. But once again, my challenges are based on, like, who can grab me first, and if I have free time. <laughs> but I love challenging people. It's fun. Uh, I don't need more crow gunks, that's for sure. Plenty of Vulpixes now, apparently. Reverse Electros. That's one rare, rare, reverse rare out of the way. Are we playing Genesect Mew? Or Genesect Celebi? Because that's going to be unfortunate. Looks like we are, so that's unfortunate. <laughs> Sophocles. Sophobad. <sighs> Got him. <laughs> uh, again, da, da, do, ba, do, ba, da. Hi, there we go. Watch him play Genesis Celebi deck. Why did I Why did I predict that? I pulled a Japanese hybrid ne Necrozma. That's dope, bro. 
I'm gonna send you a case of bulk to sign each individually. Bro, you gotta, you gotta send me a lot of good stuff if you want that to happen. Each of your Pokemon that has any grass energy attached to it uh, cannot be fixed by special conditions. So that means this is pretty much useless, right? That's what that means. So I can drop this and this, yeah. To grab Jirachi, which should be here. Oh no, never mind, no Jirachi. Um, oh, I guess that makes sense because we play, what's it called? But oh, we're stuck. Um, that's unfortunate. Guess we'll grab a Trubbish. How's EV light work? It's reduced by 20. I guess that's decent. Uh, I think we'll, we'll see. He can do 50 damage to me. Uh, this can do, hmm. I don't want to attach it yet. I think I'll hold on to it for now. Uh, to grab Jirachi, which should be here. Oh, nope, it's priced. I don't even know if it's priced, to be honest. I might, I might just not play it. That could be a definite possibility. Okay, he's an enemy. That's good. Uh, okay, where is it? Here it is. I'm going to put these in the trade binder and this in the reverse hollow binder. I'll just add these over here. Did I ever... Oh, no, these have to go in the collection binder. And these got to go in the promo binder. Oh, I keep forgetting to do things, but this works. It's my turn. Oh, dope. We finally got a hand. Um, all right, what are we going to do here? He attacked me, which is fine. We can do this. Um, he has a grass energy, so that's not very useful. But I don't want to lose all these fighting energies. But I don't know what I can give from the deck that would actually help me right now. So I guess I'm just going to play Juniper. Yeah, I want more things. We can scoop up. Uh, I can grab Ultra Ball if I really wanted to, but I'm not going to be able to discard enough cards to do that. So I'm not going to do that right now. I'll save the Max Potion play. I'm going to attach one for now. And I will X Ball. How much is that going to do? 80 damage. Oof. I guess with another attachment I get a knockout. What have I missed? Hey, we're just doing some legacy while we talk about... Oh, of course. While we talk about... Um, about, like, updates for the channel regarding mats and whatnot. No, my Trubbish. No, I needed that. That's unfortunate. Oh, well. Start off with 100 Guardi. Start off with 100 spread to all their Guardies, and then Espeon to pretty much win. Okay, and all their Ralts, Corellias, Darkrai to Marshadow. Copy, copies, Nova and GXs, and Wide Lens combined. You can't use Wide Lens. It's expanded. I guess well, post-rotation, it's expanded. So that's not going to work. But yeah, I see what you're saying. Oh well, looks like we're gonna keep going with this. I wanna turn off abilities, but whatever. There's a Lando. We'll do this. And I guess we just keep attacking. I'm trying to think of what else I wanna do, but I don't have anything to do right now. So, sure. The best card move in the format, pretty much. For worlds, I mean, yeah. I mean, that's cool. I don't really bother with worlds because I'm not playing in it. I would play PC, but my phone does not support it. I do not have a computer. That's fair. That's a fair reason to not play it. Uh, where is my Sun Moon Binder? Here it is. Hip, no, what does that do? I don't know what these cards do off the top of my head. I think it hits for like 200 or something. I don't remember. Psychic, Psychic cards. This is Sun Moon Base. Yeah, okay, 200, that's what it does. Whatever it is, like energies. Yeah, here we go. That's unfortunate, to say the least. So now I don't have any energies to attack with. We'll do this. I'm weak to grass though, right? I'm weak to water. Why am I not getting anything? Hmm. That sucks. I guess I just have to max potion super scoop up for a bit, because I can't do anything. Oh well, that's the game, I guess. Can't control it. Uh, 
How am I gonna win this? G booster does 200, thank you. At the cost of discarding. Oh, discarding two energies. Okay, that's how it works. And then he just sets it all up again. Ugh, what a pain. And he has a smear goal. What's your favorite evolution? I don't know. I like Flareon a lot, just because Flareon seems like the most pet friendly one. Alright, so we're just gonna get body bag this game, is what I'm being told right now. Come on. You cannot be serious. <sighs> Alright, whatever. Are you going to open a postal box for fan mail? I mean, I could. I mean, you know, I don't have to happen to. I, well, I don't have a lot of people that send me stuff, so. I mean, if you ever want to send me anything, just DM me and I'll tell you the address. Oh, this is unfortunate. Talk about, like, the worst game. But yeah, any, any fan mail I'd probably open up on the channel. As, like, an extra video for the week. I would love an N right now, that'd be pretty clean. And I'm down to one and just do my best to win this game somehow. I have to get rid of this as well. Hmm. Alright, let's even get a Pokemon down. Nope. This doesn't work either because abilities are active. Let's get an Ultra Ball, I guess. Junk Arm. Lose these two. I don't know. I mean, I have to do this. I'm super stuck now. Uh, and I have the Ultra Ball just to get another Pokemon down. So I don't lose this game soon enough. Uh, we can do. We can do those two. Uh, I guess we'll get down Trub. We just need a top deck now. That's the, what it's come down to. Send me some gifts from the QK. What ETB did you open? I opened a uh, the new one, Burning Shadows one with Necrozma, and I got I got a three hit box, which is pretty rare. Tapu Fini, Full Art Necrozma, and Hyper Rare Gardevoir. So it was a very good box. I'm very happy with it. That's so nice of you, Nigos. I appreciate it. What's up, Victor, bro? Scoop? Yeah, I should scoop, huh? Keldio, what's up, man? Long time no see. Keldio, Kel the MLG. It has been a long time since I've seen you, bro. I have one question. What are those? That's a good question, the trash man. Uh, <laughs> also, Skyrim gives them free retreat so they can do Pristis over and over. Oh, that's what, oh, that's how they've been retreating. Okay. Oh, boy. Well, he doesn't win yet. He has hit for a little bit more. How's life, bro? Life has been pretty bad, but we, we live in. We power through. You know how it is. And he gets it right back. And if he has manual attachment, that's game, which he probably does. Alright, let's start with grass. Well, that was definitely a fun game while it lasted. Total of uh, getting all my scoop ups and my float stones, which there aren't even that many float stones in the deck, but we got them all. Uh, let's try that again. Bro, I miss watching you, but I just got Nintendo Switch and I've been doing some Breath of the Wild. Bro, I feel you there. When I got my Switch, I literally didn't do anything else. <laughs> I was like, Zelda time? Zelda time. It's always Zelda time. Let's play Zelda. Zelda's fun. <laughs> awesome, my younger brothers opened a GSR ATB and got two hollows. That's amazing. That's, nah, that's awesome, bro. Tell your brother I said, well played, good sir. Reverse monkey glooms and hollow gloom, non reverse monkey, and a ladybug. My internet took a poop and I am lagging. I hate you. Oh, I hate it. Okay. I was about to say, I'm, I'm sorry, bro. I wish I could do something about it. But we have 28 people here and only 17 likes. Go ahead and drop a like if, if you have not already. It's always greatly appreciated. OMG, can you add me? Do add me anytime, bro. What's up, Samuel, though? How you doing? Dude, you should play Zelda right now. <laughs> I, I can't, I don't have the cards I need to, I don't have the the technology I need to live stream myself playing Zelda. So unfortunately that's not a thing I could do today. But when I do get it at some point, I would love to. Okay, third Metapod, I would love to go first, please and thank you. Hey, what's up Jackie, welcome. By the way guys, we're on the road to 2K. Oh my God, these hands have been atrocious. We are on the road 
to 2k subscribers we're really close we are just a little bit over 60 off so if you have any you know family members you got a mother got siblings you got a dog you got an awkward cousin across the street you've got a uh, creepy teacher tell them all to come on by this is really bad <laughs> this is really bad for me <laughs> there's a bunch of good cards that just went oh, just went away there so I'm gonna ultra ball right I don't know what ultra ball for though uh, I guess Man, I need I need a better way to get supporters. This is actually getting really frustrating. I need to, I need to turn off abilities this game for sure. So let's drop switch and scoop. Get trub. Attach and hope to God we can attack next turn because this is getting out of, this is getting this is getting absurd and I'm never gonna play this deck again if it's really this bad because I remember recording this deck and having just a great time with it and now it's just atrocious I know I have plenty of glooms but I need one of them to be reversed so these glooms are bulk oh thank god play this play this we'll play this all right and we got Garb, which means no abilities. We got another energy. Um, we can start attacking at the very least. I kind of want to knock this thing out, but I think we'll be okay. We'll expo here. Bye. All right. See you later, Keldio. I'm going to get going. I'm going to get. I'm going to get going, bro. I'll catch you tomorrow. All right, bro. I'll see you around. Yeah, we're getting super close. He's gonna end me as well. I had to get every single regional event this year, so I have to go to every single- Oh, good luck, bro. So, it's a, it's so hard burning shadows are in the shops when no one wants to sell me any packs. <laughs> you can find different packs, I'll buy them, bro. Alright, let's get some damage here. Nice. Go to sleep. And we'll take it. We will take it. Alright, let's try this again. We're gonna keep playing this deck for a little bit, and then hopefully we can make a comeback after that garbage first game. Um, we're getting games quickly though, that's actually really surprising. I have all the Lady Bow in the world, so I need more Lady Bow that can go to bulk. Tangla, Tangrowth, another coin, there we go. But, but I'm really excited for this set guys, it looks like this set's going to be treating me very well in like Guardians Rising. I mean, online it treated me very well, but IRL treated me like absolute garbage. So I'm hoping for the best here. But that kind of tells me that online, Guardians Rising or Burning Shadows is gonna treat me like garbage as well, which I'm not excited about. What's up, Mitch, bro? Do you play with real cards also? Yes, I do. I'm a master set collector and I go into tournaments, so. I do play a lot. I am a big fan of Pokemon. Let's do this. Let's play Verbank. Ultra Ball away. These two for. Landorus. And we can Juniper. I'm going to guess HP. He is up against Ray Eels. Yeah, I guess so. Regardless, though. That's good for me. Sycamore here. Alright, the hand's not awful. Put down a Mewtwo. Just going to come in handy, I guess. Uh, I don't think he's going to be able to attack turn one. I don't think this deck has the ability to attack turn one. So I'm gonna go ahead and just throw out my Lando here. Do I want a junk arm? No. I'm gonna probably use that loss removal. I don't actually I don't think I'll use it this game. But it's there. Um, which card do you think is better? Lapras or a little Night Tails? I honestly can't tell you. They're both really, really good decks. I don't know which one's better right now. Um, post format especially, it's hard to tell. In a couple of weeks I'll let you know. But for now, I have no idea. Are you going to try to... Yes, I'm going to do my best to go to Dallas Regionals. I know everybody wants me to, so I'm going to do my best, guys. Burning Shadows' favorite deck? I have a lot of fun with Glowspod. Gardevoir and Glowspods are both, my, both some of my favorites right now. So, yep. All right, fourth. Is this, this Pan Sage is bulk. I don't know where wind pods go. What number are they? Number 16. 
So they go right here. Although I have all of them, just one for the binder, I guess. What if what what it do? It's your boy. What's up? What's up, bro? What's up, team? Bad deck. Nice to see you again. What does this do? Hammerhead. Thirty damage. One of your opponent's Pokemon. Be opponent's bench Pokemon. So we can hit this thing for a little bit of damage, and then we can almost knock this thing out. Is it worth trying? I don't think it's worth trying. I think I'll attach here for now. No point in scooping up. I'm probably going to play N. Uh, is there anything that's worth junk armoring for? Because I could play Ultra Ball right now and turn off his ability so that he can't actually beat me. And I think that's the better play. 1-2, one, 1-2, two, one, two, N. Do I want to do that right now? I guess now is the best time to do it. How many, how many energies? Ah, the sooner the better, right? Let's try it. We get Ultra Ball. I hate that I'm losing all these cards, but like, I think we'll survive. Because I have to turn off his abilities. Because his deck is ability heavy, and turning off abilities is good. We'll end here. The Clefairy tech? I, I think it's cool. I'm, I'm probably not going to play it myself, but I definitely think it's a cool, cool tech. Uh, let's see if I can knock out one of those Pokemon down there. Yep. Give me a Tynamo. And we will hammerhead the benched Rayquaza and get a knockout here because of weakness. Nice. Okay. Let me... Grass, are you almost done? Do I have four dupe hiders? I do not. And I know that's my second Araquanid. Alright, so Grass is done. Let me catch up to the chat now. Alright, let's see what's going on in the chat. Before we move on to the next type. Um... Oh, what card do you think is better? Burning Shadows, favorite deck? What is it? Pokemon, gotta catch them all, not catch them all. Gotta collect them all, I see. You gonna try to go to the Worlds this year? Uh, no. I don't think, I don't have any plans on going to the Worlds this year. We you make a Martial Art GX with Clefairy that could copy attack for three colorless? Don't you need a Fairy Energy to attack with Clefairy? I don't remember, but I think it's pretty decent. I have 12 codes to do, and to do when I get Pizza Geo. I mean, pass them over, bro. <laughs> I'm playing, I'm paying, boy. Hey, it's dope. Um, yeah, we still have that donation perks going on right now with a uh, top three donators of the month. Top three to five donators of the month will get a signed card from me as well as a chance to win a Tapu, uh, Tapu Lele Full Art on PTCGO as well as, do I get a knockout here if I retreat? Um, as well as a Seeker Enhanced Hammer. One, two, three, four, five is only going to do 100 damage, right? Is that how that works? Yeah, so it's not enough damage yet. Because I can damage it one more time. He's not going to be able to knock me out. I'm trying to think if there's anything I really want to do here. There's nothing I really care about grabbing right now. Uh, let me just attach. And attack. I don't have to do too much here. You can do damage on the Keldeo. Do you play COD? I do not play Call of Duty. My brother does, though. How many packs of computer search worth online? Anyone know? I have no idea, but you should definitely get one if you're going to be playing Expanded. That and Mimic U2. Oh, that's going to be a fun one, actually. I made a new channel with a legit email, so we got to start adding content once we get decks uploaded, pretty much. Tomorrow. Yeah, I have I have over 100, finally. I'm still trying to get as many as possible so that I can um, so that I can open all the packs on PCGO here for the channel, so I can do as big of an opening as I possibly can. So, if anybody wants to donate codes to your boy, let me know. It's always greatly appreciated. Oh, he guarded my floatstone. I didn't even realize that. Nobody told me. Why didn't you guys tell me? <laughs> it's not y'all's fault because it's like super duper late. Oh, I messed up. Now he can. Now he gets a knockout. That's really frustrating. Your stream keeps buffering for me. It's fine on my end. So uh, you might want to check that out, but it looks like it's performing at decent, decent. It has a decent performance level. Nobody told me that this was gonna happen. I didn't even realize I, I have a float stone in my hand. <laughs> Rip me. It's okay. I get a knockout here. I well, I do after I touch an energy, which is gonna be easy enough. There's another Landris. Let's do this. 
junk arm, or I could ultra ball, or I can computer search for an energy. I have all these options right now. <laughs> I think I'm gonna computer search for an energy. Let's see. I can also get laser and attach energies later. Because that gets me the knockout anyways. Because I have Verbank. I can attach energies to different Pokemon this way. Dope, I'll take it. I don't have any more DCE, so I'm going to keep in mind. We get our knockout. He can't do anything with this. Um, unless he gets rid of another energy card. Oh, if I only had another Trubbish down, that'd be really nice. Uh, yeah, we just attack here and get our knockout. What packs do you need? Just uh, all I need is the Burning Shadows packs right now. Uh, oh, he would have used Junk Arm to scrap to scrap it. Yeah. What if I destroyed all my codes that were not redeemed and didn't care? What would you do? I have twelve codes. I wouldn't do anything because it's out of my control. I mean, people are. That would be that'd be just a waste, which is always sad. But what can you do? One of my friends just started playing Pokemon cards, and in her first pack, she pulled a Shaman EX Full Art. That's kind of wild. Tell her to sell it so she can buy more packs, since you know. It's an expanded now. I opened a booster box today, so I have some codes of Guardians Rising. I mean, you can pass those over too if you want. I mean, I'll, I always take I'll always take donations, but like right now, the main cards I need is new stuff, Burning Shadow stuff. Did he get rid of my Flowstonian? I have another one to replace it, I guess. Oh, there's a color. Oh, wait a minute, that doesn't affect me. He hasn't got rid of my stuff yet. I don't know. I guess he didn't have it in the deck. What's this? What's this do? Once during each player's turn, you may flip a coin. If heads the player searches his or deck for disco pile, uh, for a basic energy card, show it to the opponent and put it into your hand. So what he just did is... Okay, that's cool. What's up, Robert? Hey, wait, you're a new face. and Oh, no, my shed is also a new face. What's up, guys? Nice to see you guys joining the stream. Um, so I can hit for 100. And then this would make it... 1... 30 with or one I guess not much once during your turn you may flip a coin if heads the player searches his or his card for basic energy card so I can just do this whenever I want that's cool um I want to play N because I don't like him having that many cards in his hand I'm gonna start loading up another Pokemon that's laser here probably should have put that on this but whatever it doesn't matter uh, I guess we play I want to play N because I don't like him having that many cards in his hand, but I don't I don't want to be in an awkward place if I play N. Because he's in a bad place right now. So I don't think there's a point in playing N. There's no basic energies for me to shuffle back that's worth doing right now. My hand is so good, I don't want to lose it. So I think I'm just going to attack. I had a great Goose Box open today. Oh, tell me about it, bro. Ooh, okay, he's awake now. Put the codes up here from the community. What's going on? <coughs> yeah, if, there, if anybody wants to put codes in the chat, I'm not going to take them because I figure that's better for the viewers. But if you want to give me any codes, just PM me or let me know or something. Uh, I was a pack battle. My little brother lost by one point, but we pulled Lele and Hyper Wishy Washy. That's dope, bro. Congratulations. How is Muck GX in Expanded? I'm sure it's great. I actually think Muck is, ama is an amazing card in Expanded because you have so much more going for it. Just Hypnotoxic Laser already gives you like 130 damage. Alright, we're almost done with that. Once we finish that, we'll be good. Um, should I fully bring out my Guardian? I want to, but the Gardevoir GXs are like $50, $60 a piece right now, and I don't have that kind of money. So I have one Hyper Rare. I'm missing two more, I guess. But I'm probably going to sell them at first, because I have Ninetales. I'll just stick with Ninetales Bling until I have the money for, Hyper Rare, for Gardevoir Bling, because I want to play Gardevoir as well. I have the three secret rare rare candies that I would need for the deck. How's it going? Playing expanded legacy. We're playing some legacy right now. But what's up, Zero Lock? If you can afford it, I think yes. Gonna go to bed. All right, see you later, trash man. All right, so grass is done. Fire is next, and then water. We have three fire cards. <laughs> Let's see. Do I have four Charmanders? Yeah, I do. Do I have four Charmillions? I don't. Do I have? Oh, this is where's that reverse pants here that Devin gave me? I know he gave me one because I needed because he wanted me to have it for the hyper rare collection or for the master set. I don't know where it is. Though. It might be on here. 
It's not in here. Is it in my backpack? It might be in my backpack. It is not in my backpack. Which means that it's probably with my personal collection somewhere. I'll have to look for it later. What's this? This is my Umbreon coin I was missing. Um, mm -hmm. It might be my other binder. I should probably look for that now, huh? Oh, we got a game. Cool. Let me check if that pants is in here. Let's see if that tail does not fail. Ah, oh, of course. Every time I say it doesn't fail, it's like, oh yeah? Let me show you. Uh, I gotta put Metagross in here really soon, because I feel like Metagross is really, really good at Mimikyu and Necrozma's techs. Uh, decent lead. Very good start, actually. Oh, we're going first. Oh, okay. That's weird. Our hand is actually not good for a first turn. It's not bad. We need to top deck something, though. Aura, I'm shook. Tell me, Amanda. How shook are you? Tell me about all your shookness. I don't know where my pants here is. It's probably with some of my other cards somewhere, but that's kind of frustrating. Um, Alright, back to focusing on the game. I gotta do this crap between games. Did I miss Waylord? No Waylord. <laughs> What's up, Sarji? What's the website for those mats? Wanted to check that art on them. Uh, it's in the Discord. Somebody will probably link you. You're Tina. We're playing something with dragons. Oh, no, this is Psychic. Oh, I'm weak to this. So I gotta be careful. I don't want to put down anything that uh, that would hurt me. Do that. And we will do this. Dope. And I guess I'll just pass with that. So I don't know what I want to play as my main deck yet. I can't decide. Well, I mean, whatever you want to do, Ty. If you're ever around and you have the cards on PCGO, we can practice together. Ink gaming. Yeah, ink gaming for the mats. Uh, what would you trade for Rainbow Toxapex? Well, I don't have one, unfortunately, so can't help you there. Check my recent video for the codes. So 1,000 pack opening, and they only pulled one uh, regular art Gardevoir. Yeah, it's luckily I pulled Full Art and Hyper Rare already, but no regular arts yet. So I'm glad that's out of the way. Uh, Dream Repair, there we go. That's what that's the top tick I was looking for. Um, no need to play Scoop Up, no need to play this. We'll just play this down, and hopefully he can't punish me for it. But we can play this. We can get we can get uh, I think a second Trubbish maybe. Uh, no, it's screwed. We'll just get a, we'll just get Garbodor. Played against Metagross with the Tech Alola and Nine Tails. Oh yeah, people do that sometimes. I don't like it, but it's a thing. Yeah, I do agree with that. Well, uh, team bad deck. It's not hard to beat Alola and Nine Tails if you're Metagross. There are ways around it. Start adding up the damage. We got junk arms, DCEs, more lasers, colorists for later. We got a good hand for next turn. It's hammerhead. So we kind of oh he has rock guard? What the hell does that do? Hold on, I gotta see what Rock the Guard does. I've never heard of this card. If this attack is attacking you by the disappointment knocked out, put six oh it does six damage every time I attack him? That's broken. It's also weak to dark. Was it my turn? Wait a minute, how much HP does I have? I guess it is my turn. So that's his game, right? This is weak to Psychic. So I hit it for 60, and then Hypnotoxic. I need to switch, which I know I have switching cards down there. Um, and what do I have? I have Super Scoop Up. So let's try to land the Super Scoop Up, I guess. If we land it, we just win. <clears throat> nope. All right, well, uh, I can just get a switch card, right? I think it's in the deck. I don't. I don't remember if I play switch, but I should play switch. I know. Oh no, I know. I play one switch at the very least, uh, and it's on the deck. Unfortunately, that kind of sucks because I just wasted my supporter for the turn. Uh, I can play another scoop up, I guess. Yeah, I just wasted my supporter. Oh, I have floatstone. Never mind. I didn't see the flow zone. I forgot about flow zone. Sorry guys, super inexperienced with this deck because I don't play Legacy. Uh, there it is. Do this. And we can just attack for game. Alright, we're probably going to switch decks here, so we'll probably get one more game with this deck and switch it up. Alright, back to the 
chat one more time. Hopefully we can get this by the end of the stream. That'd be pretty nice. Um, they're leaning toward Dude, Glissbot's a lot of fun. You gotta be careful because there is a Volcanian in the format, but you can be Volcanian. Oh, right, I just got Guardian GX Rainbow. Oh, you got Rainbow Rare? Yo, this taco. No shed, my shed, bro. We gotta trade later. Dark Ride GX Rainbow Rare? Dude, trade with me, bro. I want those. A Champ Rainbow Rare, Celeste Rainbow Rare, Full Art, Muck. I want all those cards <laughs> because I am looking to finish the Master Set. So if you want to, if you ever want to trade with me, just hit me up on Discord, bro. Gira Hex. What does that do? Okay, never mind. I had no idea what he's face. We be on the Tang, second engine is 80, hyper weakness. Okay, sounds good. Hmm. What do you guys think about playing Switch and Lapras? I don't like it personally. I give you Rainbow Talk Specs, what would you give me? I don't have a Rainbow Talk Specs. I don't need a Rainbow Talk Specs. I don't need anything except for cards from the new set. It's an A spec that does 60 damage. Yeah, Zarlog, it's hard to pick a deck because there's so many good decks now. Like, it's off the top of my head, Volcanion, Metagross, uh, Ninetales, Lapras, Green Ninja, um, Galissapod, Gardevoir, Tapu Koko, Dark decks, Dark Red decks, um, Garbodor decks are still a thing. This is a thing, didn't know that. It's, it's not a good thing, in my opinion, but it's a thing. Shoshi got second at the tour. Shoshi GX, I had a smallish tour at a local card shop. It's a regular art, not Rainbow Ray. It's funny. Oh, regular art. Oh, okay, never mind. Well, regardless, I still need them all. <laughs> well, I'll let you know. And whenever I get my boxes in the mail, I'll let you guys know what I need. Because once I open up my seven boxes, that's whenever I need to start trading and... Um, trading and stuff because I don't have anything from the new set to trade right now bar like supporters and stuff like that like if you want a bunch of Guzmas and Acerolas if you want a bunch of staples that's probably usually worth one decent GX because the staples are super duper good in this set Quadrate plus Volcano will be a thing bro I don't like it I, I know that you said you liked it I'd rather play ho -Oh. I think ho -Oh is superior to that deck in every way ho -Oh is just so good right now because it's easy to set it up it hits for 190 which is insane because one steam up means you knock out all stage ones, two steam ups means you knock out two stage twos, and that's assuming you're not all stage twos, and that's assuming you're not playing choice band. With choice band, you usually only need one steam up, which means that the deck itself takes a lot less setup. And then, unlike Turnator, you don't have to discard the energies. You just do the same thing that you do with Lapras. You play switching cards, or you switch more often, like things like that. And between Guzma, Escape Rope, Switch, Acerola, you will have plenty of ways to make a Pokemon active again. You can even play Zorark with it. It's so good. Like, to whatever, um, what's his name, Wasi guy, um, PTCG Radio. Like, I think he's a great guy, but I think he completely forgot about <laughs> Ho as a card when he was making that video. I think Turnier is good because of his GX attack. Um, but Ho as an attacker is way too good. Especially since if they retreat on you and if you don't get a knockout, you can snipe the bench. Oof. It's it's pretty good. I'm, I'm, I'm a pretty big fan of it. Let's see if we're going first. I really can't wait to play Ho-Oh. ho is something I can't wait to play because I would love to have a deck that isn't Volcanian that's fire that I would like. Because <laughs> it's hard to me to find fire decks that I enjoy playing because Volcanian just leaves us bad taste in my mouth. Once again, we never really start with a supporter. Even though we play like 12 draw supporters, like. Four Junipers, four Oak, four N. I think Guzzlord is going to be the highest HP basic GX. I think so too. Check your trades, well do, bro. Um, I don't know what I want to trash. It looks like we're playing the mirror though, so there's not really a point in trashing anything. Man, I'm so late. No notification. I'm actually not that late. We've only been streaming. Oh, actually, we've been streaming for about an hour. Never mind. The being going to build Tokugou, but I don't know if it will be my main right now. The Nine Tails love. Right now, it's Nine Tails. That's my boy Ty. He knows. Um, I don't know. You either you shouldn't play. You shouldn't play both uh, Galispod and Tapu Koko because they're really really similar to each other. I'm thinking Quad Turbo for the Dallas Regional. It's pretty. 
I think Guzzlord GX is going to be. Okay, so I'm going to send 420 bulk for three booster boxes. Mm, quad ho, oh, that sounds good to be. It's uh, yeah, it's, at least to me, it sounds really good. Maybe I'm just a noob, but like I think it's amazing. Of course, uh, I guess we'll just deal with it though. Legacy Gear Hex is a deck that focuses on putting special conditions on Pokemon with lasers or Amon. Uh, Verbang Bangle gives 106 damage, also a plasma. Oh, that's really cool, actually. I feel like the Spot GX is a highly overrated, to be honest. If it's going to be a basic, it's not going to have 260 HP, let's be real. It's going to have a lot of HP, though. Hi, please shout out. What's up, hi, please shout out. How you doing? I'm going to play for my League Cup, Alone Mux GX. Hey, it sounds like fun, dude. I think Alone Mux GX is a fun card, and I can't wait to give it a try more often. Uh, there's no point in me playing Trub. Uh, no point in me playing Laser, either. I could scoop up and Cold Race for two. I don't think that's a good play either. I'll just I'll I'll save it for now. No point in playing too much, I guess. With the damage rack up. Calm stream tonight. Yeah, we're put, I'm putting away cards, doing some legacy. Like people want me to do legacy. Lucas is even here, man. I kind of I'm kind of mad. Lucas needs to show up because I'm doing this legacy for him because he's the one who wants to say like see legacy all the time. Putting all those all that damage on the board, and I'm not okay with it. Land. Uh, I guess we'll do the full zone. Poison damage. He's gonna switch out. It's gonna be annoying. He can do 60 damage with this. What's this thing do? Give him 20 extra damage? I don't know what these cards do. Um, Pokemon, this guy, oh, it gets 20 extra XP. Good to know. Um, if I need to play scoop up again, I will, but I don't have to play right now. So I'm not gonna focus on it right now. Pikachu, Tynamos. I have a Reverse Hollow Electros. That's really good for the collection. Electabuzz. Oh, it was right here. Right after Raichu. I didn't even know Electabuzz was in the set. Tynamo. What's Toby Tomorrow? 47. Mm. Electrike is here. I think I have four already. Yep. What happened? He tried to hammer me. Unfortunate. Alright, scoop up. I need you to land, buddy. Junk arm, we'll toss these two. Looks like I'm coloring for three. <laughs> That's exciting. All right, scoop up. Help me out, man. I'm gonna need you. Nope. All right, Colorus, help me out, man. I'm gonna need you. <sighs> Juniper next turn, I guess, is something. I can start setting this up so we can attack with it. I guess, do we give him the knockout? I mean, I don't have a choice. We get a knockout first, which is handy. Max potion. Ah, one turn too late, big dog. One turn too late. Token Maru, Electric, and Tynamo are our bulk. And I think that's four Token Maru. Yeah, now we have four. All right, back to the game and the chat. Ah, so much going on at once. Uh, okay, this one has the hyper. This one has the close I mean. We can max potion it up. Junk arm for Hypnotoxic before we Juniper. I guess we can do that. We need an energy to get a knockout. Boom. Dang, that's fine. This doesn't really end the game for us or anything like that. I think we win now. So we hit for weakness, right? And then the poison kicks in and does the rest. So we hit for two hundred. I think we just win. Is that how that works? Yeah, okay, we do hit for weakness. It's not like Lele. Dope. It's another game down the I might go Ho instead of regional because I'm gonna do some serious tests. Yeah, I really wanna test Ho. I might actually build Ho IRL. So am I done with this finally? Finally, okay, that's done. Uh, um you like that? <laughs> Sub dope savage. Uh Nice impacts tomorrow, dude. It's about to go down. It's about to go down.
I got six Gur to open later, IRL, but someone already pulled the Lily from the box. Rip. Just sell those. They don't even need them anymore. We miss unlucky Salty Bomb. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> uh, I don't need to do that. I just want to do my whole video. That would be worth doing. Should I Legacy 2? You can win if you get a DCE. Are you going to do get a... When the heck are we going to get a Lone Raichu and a Lone Marowak? I 100% agree with you. Not too excited about Lone Raichu just because it might not be Lightning. I'm here. Didn't know think about that. I mean, regular Raichu GX is good enough. Alright, what's next? Smart CYW? Hey. Oh, I gotta do this check, check this trade. Uh, I forgot about that. Um, let me do that real quick and then we'll come back. Four win streak, three more, pretty much. And oh yeah, oh yeah, this is the this is another this is the this is the uh, secret enhance hammer that Nico Nico is actually donating to us so that we can add this to the monthly giveaway for or monthly raffle whatever you want to call it for donations. So if you guys don't know already, to all the new faces here, first of all, drop a like. It's always greatly appreciated. Um, second, uh, for every dollar you donate to the channel, first of all, money goes to my school and to my YouTube. All of it does. <laughs> So that's always really appreciated. But um, for every dollar you donate, you get an entry. Uh, so if you donate ten dollars, you get ten entries. Uh, and then at the end of the month, we randomly choose uh, choose a number based on your entries. And uh, if you win, you get a full art Tapu Lele GX and that Seeker Rare Enhance Hammer. So if you want to donate, go ahead. And at the end of the month, by the way, for those of you that are fans of mine, for those of you that are just coming, what's up? But t the top three donators a month do have a chance of getting whatever card they want signed from me to send to you guys. Obviously, price will be an issue if you want something like a Hyper Rare Charizard for me to send you. But if it's not an expensive card, I could probably cover it. Or if you just want, like, a uh, Lucario, Riolu, Tokubi, Toki, 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 Kiss signed, I can easily do that because those are a bunch of cards I have because they're my mascots. But let me go ahead and go back to Legacy. So there, there's that. Got full art soft in the pre-release. A, that's dope. Let me check Plasma. I haven't checked Plasma in a while. Nice. I'm really hoping to put this Rainbow Charizard so I don't have to buy exactly. You know, the Alolan Playmat is sick. Alolan Playmat, pretty much. Me too. That card is basically a booster box. I'm going to try to pick a GGX from my GGX deck. I would, it would be kind of unique if I made a Alolan Raichu GX Psychic and have Fighting Weakness instead of Psychic. That would be pretty nice. Alright, so what does this do? I don't really like this deck, if I remember correctly. I really don't like playing this Plasma deck. I'm not going to play it. Excel Gone is fun. I played a person against it. It's just, it makes for long games. I don't want to play it. Corvette Prime. What did it do again? Not Poison. Put four damage counters instead of one on that Pokemon between turns. Um, so you can do a lot of damage with Poison and uh, Skill Dive. So you damage to any Pokemon. Uh, that could be interesting. What's it weak to? Is it weak to Psychic? That's kind of bad. Because, oh, it's weak to Lightning. No, no, I haven't seen a lot of Lightning decks out there besides Ray Eels. So that could be interesting. Uh, sure. We might try that out. Darkrai Legacy is good. I think I might just play Darkrai just because it's decent. Junk Hunt. How many do we play of these? Three. Oof. It's kind of broken. Night Spear into Junk Hunt. We don't have, oh, we do have computer search. Mm, I might do this. What does this do? It's 20, it's 20 more damage to the active Pokemon. That's pretty decent. Um, what else do we got in here? Ninetales Moongus, Fluffy Chomp. I kind of want to do Tool Drop. We'll do Dark Ride first, and then we'll do Tool Drop, because I like those decks. What's up, Trashman? Welcome back. Seven between turns. Yeah, it's really good with Burbank. That's why I built it. I remember, I remember it being fun. I haven't built, I built these decks like, a year ago, guys, just to, keep, just to keep you guys knowing. Pretty much is what I want to do. <laughs> Same thing with Ty. I just want to have it so it's for the master set. Just put it in the binder and keep it there and never touch it again. Okay, Psychic is next for the organization. Nah, master set stuff is difficult. Oh, I bought this honey. I'm uh, not this honey, but this honey tea because my throat hurts a lot because I've been streaming every day for like hours on end. So just know that you guys are making my throat bleed. And I love you guys all for it. <laughs> I know I have four Venipedes. How many Wimpods do I have? I have two Wimpods. Um, 
what is a master set? It's whenever you get a, a each card and the reverse hollow of each card from a set. That's whenever you, that means you have one of every possible card. Mm, I have all the skull piece. Oh, this is a reverse, this is a reverse hollow. I don't have this. What's my opponent? This is my hand. My What's my opponent playing? Uh, ooh, the worst start. Did I not look at my opponent's hand, or was, or was their hand the dark hand? Okay, so they're playing something with evolutions and fire. Don't know what that is, because I don't play this tier. I have four Sandy Gas now. I have three Wobba Fits, all the Crow Gunk in the world. Would you like to draw a card? Yes. I have all the Duskulls. Do I have all the Meowstics? I should have all the Meowstics, but I don't know if I have all the Meowstics. I have no, not enough Meowstics. Right, so Psychic is done. Back to the games. Alright, what do I want to do? Um, oh, something, I don't know what Embor does. Somebody let me know what Embor does while I play this game. The Patreon rewards, you sh uh, Patreon your oratories would be the Togekiss line, pretty much. That'd be really cool, actually. Uh, we'll do this. I don't know why I play this. Because I have Darkrai and its ability, but that's fine. It's not my deck, so I don't care. Um, I could get a dark type card, I guess. I don't know what I want to do with this. Because I don't really want to play this card. Because I'm going to play Juniper this turn. Uh, I don't know. I guess I could try to get Oak. <coughs> Oak. Um, but I don't want to lose anything. I didn't want to lose this dark Darkrai, that's what I'm essentially trying to say right now. But whatever, we're going to lose it. Let me get Darkrai down. Losing Jirachi kind of sucks as well. I guess I could have got... I can get Oak this way with Jirachi. So I guess I'll do that. Whatever. I don't want to lose cards. <laughs> N is not as good. Because I would give him more cards. We'll play Oak. Yeah, we have an attachment for the turn. We could also dark patch it, but I don't feel like that's necessary. Oh, I guess I play it for like paralysis effects and stuff. It seems weird though. I'm trying to figure out what I want to do, but I'm kind of stuck for next turn, which is unfortunate. Oh, well, I'll pass. What's up, a lazy squid? I need to pick up some old Gengar cards for the collection purposes. I would collect other older charges, but they're ridiculously priced pretty much. And pick up some Quagsires. Oh yeah, I forgot that you're a big Wooper fan, Amanda. The damage. What does this do? Switch your deck for basic energy card? So I'll let me, I'll take it, whatever. Energy is good. And stuff. I'll just keep taking damage until I can set up an attack. I don't think there's any card I can dig for that would help me right now. I guess I could have dug for Junk Hunt and then attacked with that. Probably would have been my better play to be honest, but whatever. Too late now. Ooh, by the way guys, go ahead and drop a like if you haven't already. It's always greatly appreciated. Oh, another random receiver. Just what I needed. Uh, ooh, N is good too. I'll take the N. Do I want to Ultra Ball for anything? Well, I can. Uh, is that worth doing? Why did that move? That was really weird. I don't know if I like that. I don't need catch it right now. Let me just go ahead and get down to Sableye. Um, oh, yeah, okay, touch plus on there. It's good. I was like, what did I do? Then I realized it wasn't a mistake. It's okay. We'll play N. Train GX has been added to PCGO. Cool. I need to get that. I haven't got it yet. Um, I'm kind of stuck. Did I attach for the turn? I don't think I did. So I'm not actually stuck. Never mind. Um, I don't know why he's doing that. He's about to get knocked out. Let's do the damage. Bad opening Pokemon. You want Sableye there? I guess Sableye would have been an opening po a good opening Pokemon now that I think about it. But like, I don't know. There wasn't really too much I wanted to do there. I'm glad Richard is here though. Richard helped me out with this expanded stuff that I don't know. We're always really appreciated. 
Pass your fuller goosebumps and secret choice pants this way, please. No, don't do that. Not to Amanda, to me. Me first, talk to Amanda later. All right, what does this do? As long as you select during your turn, you may touch a fire energy card from your hand to one of your Pokemon. Oh, it's Blastoise, but for fire. Interesting. Oh, this is a Dark Room deck. Dark Ray, yeah, this is Dark Ray in Expanded, in Legacy. I will take the dubs. Give me all the dubs. I really like those dubs. Oh, why did I go to this? What's my win streak? Did I win that last game? The game before that, I mean? Oh, I did. Oh, I'm in a five win streak right now. Go Legacy, bro. Easy pickings. Easy pickings. Now you'll give me the phone. Oh, the Fuller Guzman's need to come to me first, because I'm the master set collector and the owner of the Ore Bomb Industries. So please, help me. <laughs> I will shout you out. I will give you... I will give you things. I don't know what I could give you, but I can give you things. <laughs> Fine, once Ori gets a place, I pass him this way. Yeah, okay. Amanda will be next, because Amanda's pretty dope. Or Team Bad Deck. They're both pretty cool people. But Amanda's been here longer, so I'm kind of obligated to say Amanda. Can we hit? Can we get seven wins? Can we hit seven wins? Find out. <laughs> oh, cool. Leading the same Pokemon again. But we have a good opening hand this time. And we keep going first, which is just phenomenal. Which card are you really going to miss after rotation? Not VS Seeker, that's for sure. <clears throat> Not Trainer Mail. Oh, Hex Maniac. 100%. Hex Maniac is a card I'm going to miss a lot. I kind of want to discard this energy because of Dark Patch, so I'm not going to attach it this turn. No love. Nah, Team Bad Deck. You're the best too, bro. You always keep that in mind. You're a great guy. Ooh, what is this? Rayquaza? Oh, we're playing Ray Eels. Okay, I'm going to keep that in mind as well. Um, do I want to end then? I don't need this. No, we're just going to take a more. Or Juniper, whatever you want to call it. Dark. Rye. Laser. Nice. Sycamore, or Juniper, whatever you want to call it. No dark patches yet. We do have another dark ray. We have this. And we are good for next turn. I could junk I could get junk hunt next turn. So that's something to keep in mind, but we're good for now. Nah V I don't I don't want VS Seeker, that's for sure. Nice, more dubs. All the dub give me every single dub. All the dubs. I want them all. Give me these dubs, bro. Do not let me stop getting these dubs. I want the dubs. I will be glad to see VSU go on same. The point is that you can spam junk hunt until you set up. That's yeah, I, I agree with you. I'm gonna miss Quagsire, not gonna lie. I'm, go I'm ready for that full art collection box to drop. Gonna try and buy four. Whew, boy. I'm gonna buy one and then buy the remaining cards I want online if I want to, and that's assuming I even want them. <laughs> Had a good run being a 1 4 of pre release decks. <laughs> I'm gonna miss Shaman. I don't give a crap about Shaman. Shaman can go burn. Broken card. Should, not, should have never been in the format. Fighting. There's a lot of fighting cards in this set. It's a little bit ridiculous. This is probably going to take me a little bit longer than usual. I know I have all the Krabominables and Crab crab Brawlers in the world. So I'm going to remove those. Krabominable is actually good in the Trade Binder. So I'm actually going to put that in the Trade Binder. Oh, I lost the coin hook finally. That's sad. Uh, trade Binder stuff. Can we get a decent lead? That'd be pretty dope. Soul Rock. Do I have four Soul Rocks? I don't think I do. Yeah, I'm missing one more. What's he got? Psychic, so we already have a pretty good advantage. Just based on typing alone. The Lunatone, I need one more Lunatone. Can I get a Pokemon in my hand? That'd be nice. Uh, cool, thank you. And Dark Early, at least it's not bad. We have a good hand for next turn as well. Done. The heck with Shay, that's what I'm saying. So happy Shaman and Ray is gone. Oh yeah, Ray, um, that's another question for the day, guys. Let's go ahead and do a giveaway. Uh, after this game, I'll look at my collection and see what I have extras of, and uh, we'll do a giveaway, and, that, and keep the question in your mind. Don't answer it yet. Um, with the hashtag bless, I want you to answer uh, which card are you happy is going away after rotation, and why, but no answer yet. Keep that, oh, perfect. Keep that in the back of your mind for now. Um, guess we can grab Keldeo. Oh, this is Tool Drop, my favorite deck.
reversal. I don't want to drop laser, but I kind of have to. I guess I can just not play Keldeo yet. So we can drop float and patch to grab a another Darkrai, I guess. You gotta be careful with this deck, because this deck is good. Play this. He played the Plasma Mirror, it doesn't do anything for him, but it's pretty dope. Come with Juniper here. I gotta focus on this game. Hoping I put these cards away quickly. Uh, Dark Claw, we wanna use Sableye, right? But we can't switch. So that's unfortunate. So I guess I just pass, right? I attach and pass? Sure. Uh, Rhyhorn. Right on, those are all going away. I have plenty of those. How many mud braids do I have for my Mudsdale collection? Because so it's definitely a thing that's happening. Because apparently every set has Mudsdale, and Mudsdale, I always pull Mudsdales. More Riolus for the Riolu collection. There's one in here because the other ones are in my collection binder, which means this adds to the stack of Riolus I have for assigned giveaways and stuff like that. So that's pretty dope. Back to the game though. How bad reprint win? That's what I'm saying, Amanda. Is there a way to make Metagross faster? I can't lose to Gardevoir, but I doubt there's a way to really set up faster than Bridget. There, there really isn't a way to set up faster than that, bro. Not in this format. What is the, mo what is the most unhealthy number of supporters to run post-rotation? Uh, that's a good question, actually. I have no idea. I can attack this turn while I set up some more. I guess that's cool. What's this do? Tool drop, 20 for each tool on the field, silver mirror. Uh, what does that silver mirror do again? Can you, can you please? <laughs> Prevent all effects of attacks, including damage under the Pokemon of this card is attached to, to your, from your team plasma. So we don't play any team plasma, so it's not a threat to us. Uh, Floatstone, silver mirror. I kind of want to knock these things out. So I guess we'll start by knocking out Sigilyph. Uh, it has a one retreat cost though, and I think knocking out Trubbish is more important. So let's try to get Trubbished out. Then again, what does this do again? You may move your tools. Put a Pokemon tool attachment where you, oh, you can put it back into your hand, that's right. Let me get this Trubbish. So we don't want Trubbish just setting up and apparently we can just miss everything. We'll attach this here. I don't want a random receiver because I'm gonna play Juniper. Okay, every Tails, let's just, yeah, let's, let's keep this up, right? Uh, let's just keep up the every Tails game. Uh, junk Hunt. What do I need to get? What do I do? Put two cards from your discard pile into your hand. Uh, where's my Verbank? I, get, I guess I can get Verbank now, right? You can drop N and an energy so that we can play things like uh, Dark Patch later. Is Verbank in the deck? In the deck? Yes, it is. All right, let's play Verbank. And let's Junk Hunt. <laughs> Almost misclick there. We can computer search back and we can start using Dark Patch. So we can start getting damage. Because once we start attacking, we're in a really good position. <sighs> Be where GX full or hyper pretty much. Send you a friend request from my son's account since that's the only play most of the time. Not a problem, bro. Just whenever I check my stuff, I'll, I'll, I'll add it. I'm like, a lot of those are going to be lawsuits. Like, well, yeah, but you still need to play as many supporters as possible. That's that's just a fact. Typical aura. What's up, Helio Lux? <laughs> nice to see you. Is Dark Red GX going to saw in Dark Red and Expanded? Yes. And Dark Red and Expanded, absolutely. You're, with four Dark Rides in the deck and Skyfield, you're doing an extra 80 damage. That's kind of wild. Where is Stone Lux GX Secret Hybrid? Dude, I don't want those cards because then I have to buy them. I mean, they're going to be cheap, which is good. But I have to buy them to finish the master set. By the way, we're at 30 likes. Go ahead and drop a like if you haven't already. It's always greatly appreciated. He's going to move his floatstone around, which is frustrating. But well, at least we're putting damage on the board. I want to knock out this stuff. Oh, life do? Oh, no. Not today. Not today. No, not today. I'm taking a knockout, and it's going to be that. We don't have a draw supporter for the turn, though. Do I play draw in the deck? I do. So I got to get it. Um, oh, a nice dark attachment into dark patch. Reversal, please land. 
thank you. I gotta start knocking things out that are threats to me. So now I'm doing enough damage to knock everything out. We have free retreat. You can ultra ball. Nice, I'll take it. Thank you. The dubs. The dubs. <laughs> Every dub. Give me the dubs. Alright, before uh, uh before I find the next game, I want to finish this binder stuff. Because it's kind of frustrating that it's not done yet. Because I want to put everything away. So I guess we'll, oh crap, of course. Alright guys, ask me questions. Everything fell off the binder because I'm an idiot. But I think that's seven wins, right? So now Nico owes somebody something. <laughs> we got three dark cards. We don't need any more Rattatas. Sneasels, I think I have four Sneasels. Nope, I don't, because Sneasel's a beautiful looking card, guys. It has a weird looking face. Uh, Inke, and Malamar, and boom, Dark is done. When you forget to drop it, drop a like, it or Daddy comes in and schools you. That's what I'm saying, Amanda, you gotta drop those likes. Wait, giveaway, yeah, I got it, that's right, giveaway, 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 giveaway. We hit 30 likes, I wanna do just a small TCGO, TCG giveaway. Also, I gotta add, add, accept these friends. Let me do so many things at once, guys. Forgive me. Forgive me. Um, except. Burning Shadows is pretty art. Yeah, right? <laughs> Burning Shadows is dope. I actually like the artwork of Burning Shadows. All right, collection. Let me see what GXs I have as far as Pokemon go and what I have extras of. Um, I have seven Ninetales still, so we can do Ninetales giveaway. All right, let's do a Ninetales giveaway since Ninetales is my favorite card anyways, so we might as well abuse it. Uh, okay, so once again, the question of the day is going to be, what card or cards are you extremely happy about leaving uh, in rotation and why with hashtag bless? Uh, for instance, me is Rayquaza. I'm not a big fan of the Mega Rayquaza and stuff like that. I think it's a broken deck. Uh, a lot of people agree with me there. I, I, don't, I don't hate the deck per se, but I do think it's way too good. So I'm glad that it's going. Um, so ask me for hashtag bless, but give me an answer and I'll pick a random winner for a Nine Tails GX, guys. So go ahead and do the do. Uh, Shinta, Shinotic, and, and Morlol. Shinotic being one of the ugliest Pokemon of all time. Morlol being one of the cutest. Kind of funny how that worked out. Um, we got colors to do and then items and then we'll be done. More Noibats. Where did my Noibats go? Oh, I put them in the binder because I wanted to play Noibrin for a video, but there's no point anymore. One oh nine. So it goes right here. Uh, Meowth. Do I have four Meowths? I do not. Do I have four Hoot Hoots? I do. Do I have four Stuffle? I do not. Perfect. All this is done. All right, now, crap, crappity crap, crap. I keep dropping my cards because I'm an idiot. I don't know where one of them went. Oh, two of them are there. Never mind. Oh, and these are vile plumes. I should probably keep those safe because they're, you know, kind of rare. Actually, these are pre-release ones, so they're not even hollows. Oh, yeah. well, I lost one of my cards forever. It's probably not important, anyways. <laughs> I was wondering where my Vileplumes went. Okay. Oh, I'll be right back, guys. Oh, no. She's not calling me. I thought my mom was calling me. All right, let's see. Escape rope. Uh, we have four of these. So there's actually one of these escape ropes is on the trade binder, and this is my reverse hollow one, which will stay here. Sophocles. Rotom decks. All these are bad cards, but whatever. And then Mount Lanakila. I think I have four already. That is a complete lie. There's only two. There we go. Okay. So I'm updated before I get my booster boxes. So that's pretty handy. We'll put this away for now. And now we got to put Metagrosses into my play binder. Into this page. Yes, this page. And I got to move my mucks to a different page. If I ever want to play muck competitively, it'll be available to me right there. I think I'm going to keep Gardevoir as a deck because it seems like a fun deck. So I'm probably never going to take it apart. Which means I can 
use up a page to set up that. Is there any other space in my binder though? I'm really running low on space in my binder. All right, I'm gonna just take out my proxies anymore now because I'm never gonna use them. Reverse floatstone is good. We'll move, we'll move all the proxies and make a page for Muck because we should have all of the cards necessary to build the deck within one page anyways. I'm gonna check the chat in one second guys. Just give me a little bit, I'm doing a lot of work here. This is what I do. We, I like to talk to you guys as well. So if you guys have any questions, guys, just go ahead and shoot. I will answer questions today. Um, one step at a time for this page, though. So let me go ahead and check the chat first. Proxies I can put away as well. Just put them right here for now. And organize those later. All right. Dropping them. Don't you mean making it rain, pretty much? <laughs> So anything against it if they set up? Hashtag bless. I love this hashtag bless. Drop the like. Drop those likes like they're hot pockets. Right, let me go ahead and play another game while I read the chat. Since Aura somehow miraculously unbelievably got seven wins in a row, someone is going to win four top of boom. Why don't you just spread the love between four people? I can't wait to make my no energy attack deck. Same, bro. I can't wait to play Eradicate. Shay soaks message just to play standard. Hashtag blessed. First Seeker and Shaman made the meta too fast, whereas I'd rather play have a slower one. Hashtag blessed via Seeker and Trainer Mails. I wish I had a chance of giveaway, but I never have any chance of the good stuff. Well, why don't you just hashtag blessed like everybody else? I'm just picking a random winner. Via Seeker, because I encourage risky gameplay with Sycamore and Ultra Ball, it was so insane to have access to six Lysanders or eight Sycamores or something like that. I agree. Bye, Felicia. <laughs> Zero luck. If you played four Sigmore and four more from Seekers, you deck out. Guzma adds a lot of strategy. Yeah, I agree. Well, first giveaway, maybe you can be as lucky as me and multiple others. You play four Sigmores, you deck out. Also, Lysander Guzma gives you a lot more strategy, or Lysander just play the card and magic happens pretty much. Now, if your opponent uses end, you have low prizes. Do you have a lot of bulk you don't want? I would love to have to trade for booster boxes. I mean, unless you're giving me booster boxes, probably not, bro. <laughs> Sorry. Are we going first? Ah, oh, it would have been nice if we were going first with this hand. It's actually a pretty decent hand for that. Like saying it's trump card, though. <laughs> I'm a late night watcher. What's up, Jenna, the kitty vines? <laughs> you have a um, hmm. You draw seven and you would play eight. That's 54 cards. You have 47. I have the format we're going into now. I like the format we're going to now. The game will require more forward thinking to get ahead, not just be a secret for the license. It's going to require multiple mods and set up and a little more thought. Exactly. Do you open up Pokemon cards on your channel? I will. I do occasionally, just not as much as I used to at all. The Rattata has a free attack that does 20 damage, and Dark Persian has a free attack that makes them switch. How do often do you discard a Sycamore during your games that you have a Via Seeker in? I mean, to be yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, via seeker meant that you could play very fast base. You could play risky. You never have to think about your plays. You just oh, I have. You never have to think about we had this card ultra ball either. You're just like well, I just happen to have these supporters that I'm gonna reuse later with via seeker. No real point uh, in keeping them in my hand. So I have no repercussions of discarding them pretty much. Ooh. He's not. Oh, he is playing Verbank. I was about to say, why isn't he playing Verbank? <clears throat> Lost removal can't be played. Uh, I guess we'll just attach and maybe find Keldeo. It sticks here. Oh, you're so needed. I, I don't. Sh I don't show up to your streams for a couple weeks, and suddenly you're begging for donations. Hey, shut up. Hey, I can't believe we actually pulled that off. By the way, guys, <laughs> can we talk about that for one second? And I can get laser back and end back. So I guess that's good, right? <clears throat> I guess that's okay. Let's junk hunt. Boom, boom. Oh, I can only get one card back? Oh, it's items. Oh, my bad, my bad, my bad. Oh, I'll take it. Hey, look, the broken combo. For a bank to laser to sleep, exactly. Man, Legacy's bad. 
Sticks and stones, bro. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Laser bank is one of the main reasons why I don't play. I want to play an expanded. Yeah, I don't want to play an expanded because of this card. This card makes me hate expanded. Like, expanded is already broken, but, like, you can't add Sableye. Why didn't they ban Sableye? Or, like, the, uh, the Ace spec card. I'm the real reason people watch your streams. They saw that I was showing up and they have been waiting. Dude, you haven't been on my streams besides yesterday for, like, weeks. I don't know what the hell you're talking about, Sticks, but hey, bro. Nice to see you. Am I dead? No, I'm not dead yet. Actually, if he attacks me, I'm dead. Oh, yeah, never mind. I'm dead. <laughs> cool. That was exciting. Ah, double knockout. Alright, I need this card to be gold. I need him to come up with a card that's decent. I'll take the wood. We just keep taking these dubs tonight, guys. We'll just, we'll just keep taking these dubs. These do not stop. They can't stop, won't stop. I want this tonight. And Cranium. Uh, Gamuk belongs to Expanded and Legacy. No, we watch for Salty Bomb and Cranium. Kind of like Jesus. <laughs> what? The second coming of the token minorities. <laughs> Sableye will be the best card in the format if he takes, if he can take any trainer, including support, most likely to be banned too. I want it to be banned. Beware of the False Prophet Jolt. He is not the true token minority. This is a fact. <laughs> Can't stop what button. <laughs> Mean Six have found memories from that one tournament. He's realized without force, no plume, no soul save like garb gets even better. That's what I'm saying. Oh, look at this hand. I am locked with Seism with Laser Banks with Force of Viper and Bench. Hashtag profit. <laughs> Wild. Wild. I gotta find all my Metagross stuff. What do you play in Metagross? I don't remember. Besides Metagross cards. What's special about Metagross? Is it just standard dot deck with Metagrosses as well? I think that's the case. If I can get a Sableye, that'd be pretty handy. I am locked with Thighs and Laser Banks. Yeah, your opening hand was hot. It was, it was flames. Absolute fire. So spicy. Master Ball, what the hell does that do? Switch your deck for Pokemon and put it into your hand. Okay. Good A spec. <laughs> Or how many packs you got coming when Burning Shadows, aka what deck are you going to do first? I'm going to do Gardevoir first, that's the plan, and I have a hundred and something packs. But I'm taking donations for more packs, because I haven't been able to buy any. I could potentially buy 50 more, but I really don't want to. I want to do Gardevoir, then Galissapod, that's the plan. After that, it's just kind of like what's in the, up in the air. But it really all depends on what I pull, like there's, I don't really have control over that. He's doing quad turret, is that my first deck? Is that what you just decided for me? Uh, how do I win? How do I beat this? I don't know how I beat this. If he gets a setup, I'm kind of donezo. Um, do I attach this? Because I want to keep it for Keldeo, so I don't want to attach it. Hey, look, Sticks copying Aura again. Nope, screw you, I'm doing Guardian of the Day comes out fine. I'm doing it as well, bro. Sorry. <laughs> Typical. Typical sticks copying aura. <laughs> uh, I can Ultra Ball for Float Stone and Dark Energy, and then Junk Hunt to put this stuff back into my deck. Get Keldeo down for Float Stone. Retreat. Oh. I always hate when I misclick that, when I'm about to misclick that. I guess we'll do this, right? Because we'll probably get an or something. It's the worst A spec, garbage ass A spec. Master Ball's Ultra Ball without the discard. <laughs> Guardy lol, you sheep. Oh, please, I had this fine for months. Dude, so have I. <laughs> Quick or crunchy or smooth peanut butter. Oh, crunchy. Crunchy's fun. I like crunchy more. I'm pretty sure everyone's building Guardy first. Then it's pretty much the goal, right? You do the spot though, I'm doing March Shadow Night, March 2nd. That's fine. You can do anything expanded. I will not do expanded. <laughs> Except for like later down the roll. Maybe it depends on the sandwich. I planned to cross on Metagross the moment I saw Necrozma. I'm copywriting this as an A217. 
<laughs> I'm gonna be doing Necrozma and Metagross as well, but like all those updated decks won't be coming out for won't, won't be a video until probably the week after. So be up to the pl whole plan is to upload at least every day for the next two weeks a new PTCGO video. Um, so that's gonna pick, that's gonna take a lot of work, but it's feasible at the very least. I don't think I win this matchup, guys. Something tells me that I'm not gonna win this. Uh, let's do this first. Let's do this. I need a manual attachment for the turn. Uh, I guess we play Oak. So I don't want to lose his Dark Patch. I can start attacking this turn, do the big damage. As long as I can get an energy off this. If I whiff an energy off this, I'm gonna be a sad man. Let's be real. Um. Oh, you know what I should have done? No, oh, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Play N here. I have the energy off this, and I'm a very sad man. Please go to sleep. I'm a super sad man now, guys. I don't want him attacking my Dark Ray, so I'm actually going to Sprush him. That's very unfortunate that that happened. Uh, I don't want to play down another Sableye right now, so I'm just going to pass. All these dark energies down here. I need to keep like in my tr in my car whenever I get my car back, just so all my all my energies that I might need. Probably gonna do low and muck near the end because I really like low and muck, but I'm not, I don't like it that much. <laughs> you know what I mean? Give me one second, I'll catch up with the chat. <clears throat> you know what? I'm gonna take out these proxies. I don't need these proxies. Let's go with the rest of my proxies. We'll just stick to uh, what I got for now. And then Salazzle, Salandits. And then everything else is in my other decks, so I think I'll be okay. I need a Marsh Shadow, so I can put that in Coco. It's my turn. What did he do? Did he do anything interesting? He's just setting up Big Clay, though. That's fine. Uh, Alright, back to the chat. Actually, I should probably start trying to attack, huh? He's going to be knocked out, so I actually don't have to set up on that Pokemon. I probably should, but I don't have to. Um, who can I sack off? I can probably sack off a Sableye, right? Start setting up a Sableye to attack while he while he dies. <sighs> well, Oak here. I wish I'd end now. Uh, oh, there's another Dark Ray. Uh, he's gonna knock me out, which means I can Dark Patch after that. We will Junk Hunt. Get back this. And no need for Energy Switch or Ultra Ball. Uh, I guess we get Dark Claw. Why not? Put it back. You can bench the Crosma with Bridget, guys. This is true. You can bench the Crosma with Bridget. I like, I like uh, what's it called? A Mimikyu as well. If it's peanut butter and jelly, you gotta go with crunch, but if you use banana, go with smooth. Necrozma is worse than Genesect? No, but Necrozma gives you a psychic type attacker and hits for much more damage. Let me see, like, if I remember correctly. Necrozma... Hold on, give me one second. It does 60 more damage for each energy that you discard. So think about it. If you have three psychic energy attacks, 60, 120, 180, plus a 10 damage, it's 190, plus a choice band is uh, 220. You're hitting, you're knocking out. You're doing hitting for 220 damage with no effort at all. That's kind of wild if you think about it. Like that's, that's, that's insane. <laughs> 220 damage with no effort. And all you have to do is add a little bit more psychic energy to Metagross. Metagross only needs two metal and an energy to attack. So you actually don't even need a bunch of metal energy deck. You just have to make sure they're in the discard pile. Um, I want to knock this out. I don't think I'm going to be able to knock it out, but if I can land heads on this, maybe. Uh, do I go for the heads? Because I'm only going to be able to hit 90, 110 with the damage. I gotta knock this stuff out. I guess I can just spread damage, but... If he can't attack, then I'm in a good position, right? See if I can get heads. There we go. Uh, we'll see if I can get something good off this. Juniper? Ugh, that's unfortunate. But we don't want to play this, so we'll play the Juniper. We whiff the card, but we don't really need the card right now. Um... Nothing to play. The Night Spear. And we'll damage this. 
damage the attackers for now. I guess I could damage these, but there's not really a point. Oh, but he's playing this, so I guess in the end it doesn't matter. Oh, he woke up. Dang it, I was really hoping he wouldn't wake up. Jensen doesn't force you. That's fine. I mean, you want to be, you want to lose your energies every single time. And yeah, that's all. All right, Friday. You can bitch the cross with the guys. I mean, if you look at it, he, he, he used Junk Hunt to use Master Ball pretty much, doing the Ultra Ball cost. I mean, Kerbomino plus Max Ball is going to get V tier 1 pretty much. I think you're all missing the obvious Salazzle and Luck. I'll knock yada yada. Easter Wolf and the Salazzles, don't think, just trust. Dude, so, a little Luck's fun. Ugh. My Mouse would definitely get 5 Wassies. <laughs> Like, Genesec, bro, like, if you attach three energies, right? How much are you doing? 100? Yeah, I think you're doing the same amount. I don't remember, actually. I should probably check, huh? And I have my binder somewhere. Oh, he got my knock. He got the knockout. That's unfortunate. I can get a knockout here if I can get two... Two... Thingies, whatever they're called. I guess... I can also get a couple other things I can potentially use. Um, I want to get a knockout here. Let me Ultra Ball. Let me see what's in the deck. Dark Patches, that's what they're called. Get another Dark Ride down, which is probably the best thing to get. There's three Dark Rides of Dark Patches left in the deck. And uh, if he stays paralyzed, we can... Oh, wait a minute, he has Keldeo. We have to get what's it called as well. The thing that removes tools on the field, which I don't think is in this deck. Uh, it does not look like it. We'll get Dark right down. Uh, we might be able to win this game. I wish we had an end, to be honest, but what can you do? Oh, we got both Dark Patches. Shout outs to that. Uh, he can get a knockout if he gets... I don't see a way he can get a knockout, never mind. Um, we should be good. Uh, we can play that later, we can play this later, play this now, get a retreat, and we get our knockout here, and we can't use the ability, but whatever. Two prizes, alright, now all we gotta do is knock out a lovely more, one more EX, and hopefully we can paralyze Keldeo or something. Threat just can't do. Mimic is a threatening card, dude. Confey Tech and Gardevoir seem to keep special conditions from affecting you, so it would shut down Muck, but Muck's not going to be important enough to play. Not to mention, you already don't get knocked out by Banded Muck. Because it only hits, what, 210? And you're 230 HP, so you'll be fine. Oh, you don't need that, Mr. Fred. Like, I feel like, like adding Steel Attackers that will pretty much do the same thing is kind of redundant, right? Because having a Psychic Attack attacker that can hit for big numbers is good when it blocks things like Drampa, while Genesect is cool because it bounces back tools, which is like choice ban, because you're not going to be playing like, what's it called, um, Float Stones. At least as far as I know, you're not going to be playing Float Stones. We got another one. If I can just get Sable, whatever it's called, um, uh, what's it called? I can play Reversal to try to knock this out so he can't set it up anymore. If he knocks me out, that's going to be unfortunate. <clears throat> Should I try it? I don't have a supporter for the turn, I just realized. We'll get rid of this man's floatstone, so it's kind of awkward for him. Yeah, we'll get rid of this man's floatstone. We can't actually do anything about this, I just realized. If we reversal, we can get a knockout, but that's nothing crazy. I don't want to get a knockout on this, I want him to stay in the active. So I'm going to have to hope that he can stay in the active. I'll damage Rayquaza, but it's not like it matters. Um, this is exactly a better Psychic Soul Glaeo Metagross. Be bad and play Kakui. You can also abuse Mac Potion. Which board Jason would you play in during Shine? Mac isn't a card that you can build a deck around. Guardi doesn't hit Necrozma for a weakness. Guardi does not doesn't hit Necrozma for a weakness either. But Necrozma hits for 190 to 20, and Guardi can only hit the deck back. 
for you up to 90. Well, it doesn't matter. Guardi, like the matchup for Guardi doesn't matter because you literally have Metagross. You don't care about Gardevoir with your Metagross deck. You just set up Metagross, which is incredibly easy to do because they're also setting up Gardevoir at the same time as you're setting up Metagross. So that's not a big deal. With Necrozma and Genesect and all that stuff, doesn't. you don't need to care about that for your matchups. What you need to care about is hitting decks that you can't normally knock, uh, knocking out decks or knocking out cards that you can't normally knock out using using cards such as uh, Necrozma. Now, obviously, I'm gonna, have, I'm gonna look at I'm gonna look at Genesect real quick. This is a quick refresher, is what it does. But I think I think it's a pretty good card, personally. Because I'm Metagross, so I gotta pull these out before I forget. Metagross, Metagross, Metagross. I gotta find my Metangs and things like that. Um, let me see real quick. I have all these Turtonators. Might have to pull out a Turtonator just for Ho. -Oh. Let me take a look at Genesect as well, because I'll probably put it in my binder. Here it is. 100 damage, that's 20. So you hit for 160 for three energies. You're usually not gonna have more than three energies attached at a time. So you're really only hitting for 10 more damage that a uh, Metagross is gonna be hitting for, unless you wanna waste multiple turns loading up one Pokemon, which I, which you will never, which you're never really going to do in Metagross anyways. And it's only good for its ability drive change. So I'm gonna put it into my deck. I mean, I'm not gonna put it into my deck. I'm gonna put it in my play binder because I'm gonna put Metagross in my play binder. But I don't know how good it's actually going to be in the deck. Because if you're hitting for 160, 190 with choice ban, as opposed to 190, 220 with choice ban, it's, it's, I'd rather play that. Because I'm gonna be, dis I'm gonna be discarding energies anyways because I have my Metagrosses down. It's not as easy to set up as, uh, as naturally as Genesect is. And it does, it does give you a little bit more consistency as far as getting metal energies. But I don't know. I feel like I have a good feeling about Necrozma because Necrozma can knock out a lot of things, especially if you manage to manually attach with a turn on top of using a Metagross's ability, because you can hit for what two two eighty with Choice Band. That's kind of wild. Oh, was I offline for a little bit? What did you guys miss when I was talking about? Glyph Spot is good. I don't like Glyph Spot and Zoroark. It's really clunky. And also, Zoroark doesn't really do anything post rotation. Because because like Zoroark was good for the uh, Gar Garbodor matchups, but Garbodor is not going to be as popular anymore. Also, like the whole point of Glyph Spot is to like put it back into your hand so that you don't get knocked out. It's the same thing that you do with Tapu Koko, right? You pre you, pre you prevent knockouts. So if you're playing Zoroark, you're not really doing that. Because they can easily uh, they can easily bring out your Glyph Pod again. Which is why I like four Super Scoop up four Ace Aurora and Glyph Pod. This spot isn't beating Guardi. Uh, it's gonna have a hard time beating Gardevoir. I, I did a lot of testing, and Gardevoir has such a good matchup. <laughs> this is true. It does do 130 damage, so you do knock out things for weakness. You don't need Choice Band, three Metagross, four Metagross. Will you hit 250? So Belt helps more. Uh, I don't really like Belt because Belt's literally only for Necrozma, while Choice Band is for all your Pokemon. So I think it's a little bit clunky. As long as you don't see Glyph Dude, you need to try Glyph Spot if you don't think Glyph Spot's gonna be that good. Hitting for 120, just base, that's without Lurantis, without Choice Band, <laughs> for one energy is wild. Because that means you can easily Max Potion, Super Scoop up um, Ace Rolla, and then reattach the energy, uh, have that new Glyph Spot out active, hit for another 120. With, uh, with Choice Band, it's 150. With Lurantis, that's 170. With one Lurantis on the bench, that's 170. That's already knocking out Lele's. Two Lurantis on the bench, that's 190. That's knocking out all stage one GXs. That's insane. Three Lurantis, I don't personally like three Lurantis, but with three Lurantis, you're hitting 210. That's knocking out almost every stage one uh, GX. That's crazy, bro. And that's all for one energy. It's, it's, I think it's really, really good. I know there are some people that are adding cards like Ariados to increase the damage output because that poison, that one tick of poison could mean the difference between knockout and not a knockout. I personally don't like that, but it is something you guys can try. So I just, it's not that it's, I don't think it's bad or anything like that. I just think it's hard to set up. 
Is it the day where I finally put a fire deck into my playbinder? I think I'll wait till I get all my hobos. I think I think I think I have to wait. Although hyper ho isn't until the next set, so uh, I do want three hoes though. So I think I'll get three regular arts, one full art, and go from there. All right. You don't need three choice bands or it helps. Isn't the crows able to smack around a certain fire deck? Oh, that's true. It does help in your fire matchup a lot. Wow, I actually didn't think about that. Mew Mew EX, so the Widow Clefairy and Marshadow. What about that, Chris? Used to throw back when they do and don't forget to ghost in the sack. Help, is anyone else PG just saying server maintenance servers are offline? Please try again later. It's not happening to me right now, but what's up, Jason? Um, Black Ray and Promo Tapu Coco. All, all your opponent's shame in EXs. Rip. Um, Pod is going to be powerful, I think. It will show up a lot at Worlds. I think so, too. Because Pod with the Decidueye is really, really, really good. You can spread damage on top of uh, doing all that insane damage. And then they both hit for the same attack cost. And you have a decent GX attack and Decidueye's. Isn't, isn't that for me just logged in? Shaman barely sees play now and it's going to get roasted. Pretty much. Yeah, sh nobody should be playing Shaman. Because you're putting yourself in a potentially really bad position if you're playing Shaman. What's up, Orbomb? Your streams are lit, bro. I'm suddenly I'm subbing ASAP. Hey, thanks, Jason. I appreciate it, man. We just like to talk and hang out here. Here's the Mimikyu. I gotta put this in my binder with the rest of my stuff. Do I want the hollow or the reverse? I do like the way the hollow looks, but I'll put one of each just in case. Mimikyu is so good <laughs> right now in uh in in Metagross. I'm gonna try. To, I'm gonna put in two Delmas. Do I want the Hollow or the Reverse more though? I could put, just put all four in the deck for, in the binder for now. Since I'm, going, since I'm going all in on this Meta Ghost thing in my binder. I'm gonna put, yeah, I'll put all in all four for now. Oh, here's my catcher. I gotta put this away. Do I have four Reverse Beldams? That'd be kind of cool. Oh, I'm missing one. Somebody give me Reverse Hollow Beldam ASAP. Max and Rarity Metagross, here I go. Oh, I'm missing one reverse Matang. I'm only gonna play three Matangs anyways, but like, it's the freaking, it's the, uh, it's the integrity, man. Catcher is what number? 126. Oh, but this is, uh, something based on Gargi's right now. Might be, might be, might be. This goes in Metagross, that's unique to Metagross. Bridget, the basics, Lele's, um, Delmize, is a all the cards that can potentially go in there I need to keep in the binder as well. Metagross's item cards and tool cards, there's nothing really unique to them, just play your choice bands. Uh, sure, I'm okay with this. All right, uh, let's play more games. Who got that Nine Tails aura? Oh, did I pick a? I didn't pick a winner. Oh, thank you for reminding me. Oh, thank you so much for reminding me. I have to go all the way back up now to find where the uh, the hashtag blesses were. I don't remember where they were. They weren't. They were before sticks. Oh man. I the, the chat's already gone. As far as that goes, God, I can't believe I forgot. All right, we're gonna do that giveaway again in one second, but we're gonna give away two this time because I forgot and it's my fault. So give me one second as I catch up with the chat. You grab cards from discard pile, cough Pokemon needs to make a good, make good supporters. I mean, supporters are fine right now. I don't think we should have any that grabs cards from the discard pile. I think we should have them that shuffles them back into the deck. Personally, um, awkward hand is awkward, but I'll take it, I guess. I'm thinking about Super Scoop Up coming back to the center. I'm actually a huge fan of it. I love playing that card. What up, Orb? Come in. What's up? Oh, um, Mom.
Sorry, guys. Had to make a quick conversation with my mother. Uh, I missed some things. Um, I don't want to lose the cards in my hand. I guess it's not bad if I lose the cards in my hand. Oops. I want to put that back in my hand. Whew, sorry, guys. That was not quick enough, but what can I do? Um, what's my hand looking like? See, I don't want to lose this. But I guess it doesn't matter if I lose it. Uh, sorry, I didn't get a chance to look at my hand, so I don't actually... So I'm kind of messing up here. Ah, <sighs> okay. Okay, back to the chat. Sorry. Whew. I hate when my mom comes in my room. Uh, if I play in the crowd, the will be worth playing three of six energies and five medals. We can match up against Volk. Yeah, I think you should cut down on the psychic energy, maybe like four or five at most. I think eight medals are kind of important because it's still a Metagross deck. So waiting for supporter that you grab cards when you discard cough and Sigil will definitely help. No dark patches, that's unfortunate. Um, oof, oh, that was awkward. I'll pass. Super Scoob always favorite card pretty much. And not so great dude is cussing you for slow playing probably. Yeah, whatever, who cares? He can do whatever he wants. So for those of you guys who don't know, my mom actually hates Pokemon. My family doesn't know anything about my YouTube channel at all. I try to keep them in the down low so they don't, so they don't, so they never need to find out. Um, well, my mom was just upset about Pokemon, and that's why she was yelling at me for a little bit. She is not the fan. I get a knockout if I can get a stupid thing. Um, what's it called? Uh, dark patch. But I keep whiffing dark patch in ways to get it. Super annoying. Ah, uh, man. It's actually really annoying. He doesn't get a knockout next turn, does he? Outraged. Actually, he might get a knockout, right? Because he'll take 10 damage here, putting him at 30. 50 damage on the outrage, plus... Does that do extra damage? Does 80 damage? 80's not a knockout. So I think I'll be fine. I don't want to play Verbank yet, though. So I think I just pass for now? I guess I can try to get Sableye as well. Oh, I didn't want to play that down. Oh well, it's fine, too late now. Oak does not, Oak helps me. That doesn't, and does not help me as much. I want to get a save light down, that's right. LFC, nice to see you back, bro. Yes, try to Oak If you're going to have one shot rush hammer, it's going to smack you back harder. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, what's up with Golden Nuggets, bro? Nice to see you, big dog. Genesect here. Put our Mimikyu's here. Metagross is here. Okay. Oh, what's up, bro? And tell mama we said what's up. <laughs> Thanks, man. Not a smart play. King Lao, I'm gonna ban you, bro. I just got back from having a conversation with my mom. I didn't do anything. I was not even looking at the screen. I was about to time out. So don't give me crap today, bro. I'm serious when I say I'm gonna ban you. We keep, I'm, I make it a policy to keep negativity away from the chat. Alright, let's see what we can do here. So now we can Verbank, but I need to get the knockout. I'm gonna play Verbank regardless. Oh, we have the knockout because we have the energy in hand. Alright, that's good. I say goodbye to my kill. No, my kill doesn't get knocked out. I know, I, I did the math, it's not gonna be knocked out there. And we can Oak. And then it is now in range of being knocked out. We have lost remover and nope card to deal with that today. Thank you for requesting PC Joe. Okay, I'll check it out in a second, guys. Uh, do I want to put down another dark right? Not really. My hand is good for next turn. All right, dope. Let's get our knockout here. Can we talk positively about negative things? Sure. We don't want to damage this, so we'll damage these instead. How much does this do? 130. I thought I had 110 HP. Okay, so I do want to damage those at some point. Got to be careful about that. But uh, it should be okay with laser into the knockout. I just have to get the laser. Are you talking to yourself while playing Pokemon on the computer again? I told you to stop doing that and get a job pretty much. That's my family right now. Say goodbye to my win streak. Well, I just, what do you mean? My win streak's fine right now. What does Typhlosion do, by the way, guys? I know I got some, but I don't remember what they did. Somebody let me know. 
Pause all the time as a supporter. Rock Shelf plus Pokemon Energy supporters to grab those would be great. I agree, I think it makes me happy. I'll chew by the rotary, I'll see. We can put down another one of you. Put down you. Put down you, I guess, on Sableye. I guess. I'm probably gonna Juniper. I, I probably should have Ultra Balled it, but it doesn't really do anything for me. I want, I keep whiffing. Mm, that's unfortunate. In Dark Patch. Attach one to Sableye. That way he can't do too much damage to me. Unfortunately, he's gonna set up this way, but what can you do? Attach to another Dark right down here. We can Junk Hunt for the turn, so that way we're not wasting time. What's this do? That doesn't help because we're not, we're not, it doesn't help him because we're not Plasma Pokemon. I can make him lose his energy, but this thing's not too much of a threat to me right now. He can knock out a save by all he wants, I don't really care about that. But as long as he can't knock out Dark Rise, we're fine. Lost Remover, I can hold on to that for now. We'll Junk Hunt, we'll get some of these beautiful lasers back. And Dark Claw as well. Because laser into Dark Claw will be a knockout as long as I can keep Verbank out. Could be double dragon energy's words. And that's back to the chat. Yeah, my parents aren't a fan of Pokemon, which is why they, they kinda they did like right now my mom was saying, I want all the Pokemon cards out of those cards by the end of the month, and I was like, alright mom. So that means I have to hide them again. <laughs> I don't know if all will spread energy and damage. So how does that work? I don't know what Typhlosion does. Hawaiian food right now. He lets you attach energy from your deck and you add one damage counter if you do to that Pokemon. Oh, that's broken. That's so wild. Once during your turn, you may search your discard pile for a fire energy card attached to one of your Pokemon. If you do, put one damage counter on the Pokemon. This card can't be used if Typhlosion is affected by a special condition. That's insane. We get a knockout now though, because he did that. Even if he got rid of my Burbank. Because now we hit 110, plus damage from poison. I guess we can hold on to the thing here. We can just damage from poison, get a knockout. So we should be good now, right? No thing for me to loss remover, no reason to play any other cards. Uh, yes, 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 yes. You could end me, but I don't really care. I guess I'll Dark Claw now. I don't want to though, I want to preserve him, so I'm not going to. What is Nice Spear? We'll put damage on the Typhlosion, right? This one energy touch this type of energy, this one energy touch the thing goes on. Alright, so this thing being knocked out is not it's not like a big deal or anything. Or being damaged is not a big deal. This is so expensive again too online. Yeah, I wish it wasn't either, because it's super cheap it's super cheap, um super cheap IRL, but nobody plays IRL, you know. Or I make how do me X Charizard GX Mill deck? I will, no worries. I'm probably gonna use Beware because Beware is more fun. Do <laughs> you think I'm wanting beer out of co uh, coconuts or something? What's up, the pack pro dude? Nice to see you. Sometimes this is just cool local beer with just some guy surfing on the bottle. They use bottles to surf. Typhoon is pretty much eels, but it helps with the outrage attack. Uh, so if you like spam a bunch of them, you can do big damage with outrage. That's pretty dope. Getting Juniper, that's unfortunate that he got Juniper. Let me get like oak, oak or something. If you don't want to blue flare for the KO. And how much does blue flare do? Dis oh, just discard two energy. Ah, oh, it's a decent deck. To say the least. Alright, Metagross is all set. Metagross only takes up one page. Unless there's anything specific to Metagross that I'm forgetting, that's actually really handy. This goes with the trades. And he doesn't get a knockout. He is for 30. 30 is not enough damage. I could try to knock out Typhlosion. Get a manual attachment for the turn. Because Typhlosion is a threat and a half. Uh, we do get a knockout, right? He doesn't have any more Typhlosions down. He doesn't hit for that much damage. Blue Flare with the thing would hit me for 150, which would be a knockout, so I do want to switch. But regardless, um, I guess that's a knockout. We can hit another one of these things. Okay, I have to land it though. All this talk, and I'm not even sure if I'm going to land it. Alright, cool. Alright, cool. I'll take it. I'll take it. She'll code some of my 70 meanwhile and online it's like three or four. Yeah, I bought like four of them for like 
six dollars. It's actually kind of crazy. Um, my Rush card deck was way better than this crap he's playing against. Hey, last time I mentioned it, guys, and B Joe says server main and server servers online. Please try that again. When I try logging, I just drop like 60 bucks on boosters and tickets. It'll be fine, bro. Just um, if you have to uninstall and reinstall, but like there's an update going on today and has been going on for a little bit. That's the best I can give you as far as advice goes. What time is it now? It is 11. How long have I been streaming now? Two hours, cool. So you'll be able to log in. That's 10 wins so far. We haven't lost today. Have we lost today? I guess we haven't lost since we started Legacy. But what did we play before Legacy? I don't remember. Okay, all right, everything is set. Fifty percent of his wins are scoops, not fair. Hey, they are fair because I was in such a good position that they couldn't come back. So, as long as that's the case. <laughs> Sub or for how much longer are you gonna stream? Uh, oh, Lucas, we're playing we're playing Le Legacy for you today, bro. And I don't know, we'll see. I'm just gonna keep going for a little bit. Uh, oh yeah, you lost. Oh, I did lose versus Genesec. That's right. Or oh, I saw all your Pokemon cards as bulk for money and show your mom. That's the plan. Um, I'm gonna. No, I'm, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sell a bunch of my Guardians Rising stuff because I'm gonna get a lot of duplicates and I'll show her the money. And I have to find a new place to keep my cards so I can't keep them at home anymore. But it's whatever. Ooh, right here. What does this do? Scroll energy attached to Pokemon. Attack is 100 damage to one of your opponent's Pokemon. That's broken. <laughs> That's kind of broken, but cool. I guess it's good in rate yields, right? Or I scoop so many people that they're returning the favor. What's the best way to trade for cards with a new set comes out? Uh, really rare cards, really uh, the good sets, bulk up on a lot of good sets like Guardians Rising and Plasma Freeze and stuff. And I just keep trying to log in and gave me the same error, but by the way, second, third, I got in. We got Nine Tails, that's all. Oh, I forgot Nine Tails again. Thank you. Before I forget. All right, so we're giving away two this time. So. With the hashtag bless in the comment, I'll pick a random winner. With the hashtag bless, let me know what cards you're happy are leaving the format after rotation. Uh, like for me, I'm like, I would answer Mega Rayquaza with hashtag bless because I think that card's too broken. It's too good. That's just me though. So let me know what your answer is. I have Dark Patch and this. I guess we can start the shenanigans. What do I lose? I think I lose energy switch. I want to keep it though, so I can switch around if I have to. We definitely lose this, and I think we lose. I guess N because I'm gonna give. I don't rescue stretch or random receive will give me a different supporter that's probably better. Uh, let's do dark right for now. This here. Actually, maybe I should have done energy switch. Oh well. Actually, I, I didn't think about that play. I probably should have done energy switch. I guess I can switch them around now because this gives me a retreat option later if I need to. A random receiver, give me Juniper, please. Oka, okay, whatever. Same thing as N, but doesn't give him cards. Sableye is really good because uh, I can junk hunt. Get another random receiver because we're kind of stuck. I want to bring out. Actually, it doesn't matter what I bring out because he has Keldeo. Mm, I can Ultra Ball. Not really a point. I guess I can Ultra Ball these two. Get Keldeo. Get random receiver off the junk hunt. And. Uh, I, I don't know. Maybe a dark patch, maybe. Guess we'll find out. I can probably do that next turn. I don't have to do that right now. Let's junk hunt. Dark patch and random receiver. Do I need Ultra Ball at all? I have an Ultra Ball in hand. I don't need energy switch. I'll take this. Keep your cards in a secret base. Pretty much, right? Force of Giant Plans. Well, luckily that's being banned. Bury your cards in a hidden base. Thank you so much, Obram. I hope you're right. Keep up the good work, dude. I got a crash. I have work in the morning. Birdman1480, if anyone wants to trade in me, especially you, Obram. Now you have fun. Hey, have a good night, bro. Thank you, Jason. 
Plus Mega Ray, hate it. Versus Seeker, Shaman. Okay, we got answers again. So I'll pick a winner this time, I promise. Someone get it, this is a Pokemon channel. <laughs> the Super Scoop coming back, the new metal will be one-shotting every time you swing or nothing, pretty much. Okay, I'm gonna keep your cards in your secret base. Okay, jokes. We got jokes up in here, guys. All right, let's get Keldeo. I'm a little bit worried, but we need Keldeo for sure. Let's uh, drop a Dark Patch. I'm not gonna be able to play two this turn. I'm not even able to play one. Let's grab Keldeo. I would rather play uh, Oak this turn, so let's see if I can get it off this. If I can't, then whatever. I messed up, of course. All right, well, that's fine. In the end, it doesn't really matter too much. Plus, I can probably just Junk Hunt again next turn. I need more energies to attach, more aqua. Ooh, good, this is good. I am a fan of this. Verbank, damage. Go to sleep, very nice. Manual attachments, Bip to hand for next turn. Let's go ahead and rush. Oh, he's gonna rush in himself, but at the very least, we can uh, get more cards back into our hand, because I'm probably gonna Oak. I wanna get Dark Patches in the deck. Uh, I have Oak in my hand for next turn. Yeah, I want. I also want Hypnotoxic, so let me get that as well. Do I want to keep us money? Actually, lasers aren't as important. But I don't know how many lasers I play in the deck because I don't remember. So I think I'm. Uh, yeah, I'll just do this for now. Or hide your cards in a binder near with all your school stuff. Yeah, that's the plan. I'm gonna put it in like a box where all my old school stuff is. The rotation, the best deck to counter Mega Ray, pretty much. One Ho Volcanian. Um, let's go ahead and pick some winners. So people, make sure you have the hashtag blessed in your stuff, and then I'll pick a random winner for uh, Alolan Ninetales GX, and I will combine that with another winner after that, because I'm going to be giving away two. And my English is really bad right now, but that's okay. He's going to do damage. At least he doesn't have an Electros out, or Electric or whatever. And he doesn't damage us, he doesn't knock us out, we can Junk Hunt again if we need to. Uh, but we don't need to now. Put our energies here. I wish I put my energies here, but that's fine, we'll survive. We do get a knockout. There's 90 into the, uh, the 30 is once not enough damage, I actually need to get the other thing. Uh, I'm gonna do this now. And I'm gonna play Oak. Because I don't want to lose these cards in my hand. They're all used for later in the game. If I can get the thingy, another the one of the Dark Claw things, that'd be really nice. Dope. Well, there's our knockout. Uh, <laughs> okay, then. Uh, yeah. Boom. Let me rush in. We hit for 110, plus the poison damage is a knockout. So let's go ahead and do that. Sure. It doesn't matter because it doesn't work, but that's fine. I think it's a knockout, right? Does he have 180 HP? Yeah, he had 170, that's what I thought. <coughs> blessed? I heard bless. Or bless, blessed, either one works. Are you loving the hunt, Aura? Dude, I'm loving the hunt. Let's do both. Get a Mr. Mime on your bench. Oh, it does, um, oh, yeah, you're right. I, forgot. I can use Mr. Mime to do that. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. I didn't even think about that. All right, let's go ahead and pick a winner. So first winner will be Oh, come on. Don't scroll up too high. All right, first winner will be... Uh, oh, Team Bad Deck. VS Seeker having access to 6 to 8 of any support is crazy. So first winner will be Team Bad Deck. Go, go ahead and offer me a trade for a uh, little Night Tales GX. And the second winner will be... Uh, this doesn't have a hashtag. New winner. Doesn't have a hashtag. New winner. Doesn't have a hashtag. People are saying a bunch of other stuff. Um, where'd the hashtag? Oh, Jason. Jason Fry. Fry Ealer. Fry Ealer. I don't know how to say your name, bro, but you win as well. Can I get an Ultra Ball right now? No. Okay. Uh, pff, hand is kind of weird right now. I don't know how I feel about it. I want to get damage on Rayquaza. But I can't really control that right now. Uh, let's play this. Try to set up a second one. 
I can put down a third dark ray. I guess I should, huh? So that'll be useful later. Put this here. And no need to do that. We'll just sycamore. Losing dark patch again, but that's fine. I shuffled it back in the deck for that reason. Laser. No catchers. I can play this. So now we have a second dark ray set up. Lasers into the attack is not a knockout, unfortunately. I'm trying to think of what my best play is then. I can get rid of Floatstone so you can't retreat as easily. Plus getting rid of this is super duper nice. And yeah. Laser. That way he gets knocked out the following turn if he can't retreat. And that doesn't matter because as long as he can't retreat we're in a good position. We'll Night Spear here. And whatever, it doesn't matter. What shows you can play out to Burning Shadows release some pieces of yo? All of them. It's my it's it's um I'm a war bomb, dude. I play every deck possible. Why play Rope 2 was so glad it's gone pretty much. What decks are you gonna play? Hey Mason Inferno Quester. I'll tell I'll, I'll accept it later. After the games. Who are the winners? I already picked the winners. I mean number one was Fryler. Like the E is silent. Okay, Fryler. So what did I win? You won an Alolan Nine Tails GX. So if you want to offer me a trade for whatever you want on PCGO, you can go ahead and get that. He actually got the rare candy or the float. So that is unfortunate. But he doesn't knock me out here, which is good. We're kind of stuck though for next turn. Dragonverse is going to do the damage. This is time to learn Nine Tails. Nine is a fun deck, bro. One of my favorites. I should probably save this for this, huh? I should junk hunt this turn. Cause I'm stuck. He won't get a knockout next turn if I do it with this one. So I guess I'm gonna do it this way. Get some cards I could actually use. What do I have down here? I know I have random receiver, so I'm gonna grab that. And laser as well. Laser receiver, so I'm not stuck anymore. I have 30, 15 cards up in the deck, so I have, to be, I have to be careful. But for the most part, I'm pretty decent right now. Scyther Full Art. <laughs> but alone, Nine Tails it is, so I know which one to ask for the trade offer. The regular art. I think that's the only one I have up for trade right now. I don't know if I have the Full Art for trade. I might, though. This guy, I feel bad for this dude. You didn't get a single electric out this whole game. <laughs> I'm mad hungry right now, dude. Same. <clears throat> By the way, guys, go ahead and drop a like if you haven't already. It's always greatly appreciated. He's gonna end me down to four, which is fine. Uh, ooh, hands rough though, but we have this, so we'll be okay. He finally got this down. My God, I feel bad. He can do six damage for knockout, which is fine because we have access to dark patch still. Oh, wait a minute, it's only Ice Proc out, 70 HP. Because Stabilize is broken, my bad. <laughs> uh, we will attach... Do I have enough energies? I don't even think I have enough energies in the deck to attach, because I think I only play 9. Uh, and uh, 3 energy switches are already gone. I'll probably... I'll, you know what, I'll attach, because I can always do what to call later. What do I got left? Nothing? Do I have no more supporters? Oh, no. That is bad. Um, it's not the worst thing ever, but it's pretty annoying. Um, do I want to start attacking? I guess I do. Is there anything I want to get, get out? Whatever, I can just draw everything else, it's not a big deal. Um, he can potentially knock me out, so I have to be careful there. I want to get my knockouts first. It's a little Night Spear for now. It's not going to work, but, you know, whatever. Angel Law sound delicious, ooh. Thank you so much, that's amazing. Would it be okay if it's not until tomorrow? Yeah, that's not a problem, bro. I back again, what have I missed the last hour? Uh, nothing. We haven't lost yet. We might lose here, but I doubt it. Because <clears throat> you can never, never knock out anything from full. We just have to draw really well. Oh, there's that. Oh, well, there goes the Dark Ray. He just needs one manual attachment, he gets the knockout. Does he have it? Unless he has a draw supporter. He's banking on drawing it, which could be a thing he does. Let's see, let's find out. He shouldn't have made this play yet if that was the case, though. He's on Colorist for a bunch. <laughs> a lot of cards. We don't have Colorist, unfortunately, but that should definitely get him the electric energy he needs for knockout. If not, I feel awful. 
We don't get a knockout. We need more of our things. Did he not get it? He might have not gotten it. That, uh, I feel so bad if he didn't get it. Like, that's so bad if he didn't get it. I've got to knock this thing out because it's becoming a problem. Because my lasers aren't working because of it. Colors for a million. He didn't get it. Oh, oh no, that's so bad. Oh well, I'll take it. We take those. Top deck. Oh, I keep not getting the cards I need. It's really bad because I'm out of draw supporters. Well, I guess we can damage this. He has to land another stretch, another thingy, another catcher. So both of his, uh, both of his um, Rayquazas are damaged, which means they're gonna get knocked out one after the other. Garlic Shrimp is the best facts, actual facts. He an energy from nine cards. That's so fatal. That's so me. I he didn't. I don't think he had electric energies left. I think they were all in the discard pile. Now he can start setting up for a game, but like, I think he's a little bit too behind. Guess we'll find out. Those are the grinds. Eggs are pretty good. Oh, of course. Don't land it. Ah, oh, good. Very good. If he attached here, he should have made that play first. Because if he attached here, well, I guess he couldn't have retreated, right? Oh, no, he has Keldia. Yeah, he could have retreated. So if he made that play first, and then he knew to attach all three energies to one Pokemon, he could have got a knockout this turn, and then it would have been pretty risky. Because then I'm kind of stuck. I mean, Peaches, you add me, bro. I don't add people. Oh, he did have electric energy. No, he just shuffled those back. And Collector does nothing for him, so that's pretty good for me. If I can land a catcher, I will knock this out. He's probably going to let this be damaged. Yeah, or, yeah, he's going to let this be knocked out so he can get a knockout next turn. But if he does that, I get a knockout the following turn. So it's a rough game for him. I don't know what I would get off this, but I do want to play it. Just because I want it out of my deck. So, I also want to play this down. So I don't need this and I don't need this. I'm just trying to thin out my deck a little bit. I only have one dark patch left. And I do have a dark energy left, so it is possible. Um, yeah, that's forfeit. Okay. There we go. I'll take it. We take those. Dude, we're an 11 game win streak. But unfortunately, I have to call it a stream, guys, because I gotta get some sleep and I gotta make sure I'm quiet. This family is annoyed right now. We'll go ahead and accept these requests. 11 game win streak, that's kinda dope. We'll see how far we can take it tomorrow. After Burning Shadows gets released and it'll probably be gone right away. Ugh, man. Oh yeah, so, hold on, let me check something real quick before we do that. Uh, check trades to see if I can do these giveaways. Nobody's off me to trade yet. So whenever you guys get, whenever you guys are ready, let me know. Now, as far as collection goes, let me check my collection real quick. The packs will be open and ready to open. And oh, uh, three ran also just joined the order me, so shout out to you, bro. Thank you for subscribing. He's always really appreciated. The music's super delayed, but there it is. Pink in the stream labs in a nutshell. But the set comes out in 11 hours. So at 10 a.m. for me, I guess 12 hours. But uh, yeah, I'll set a stream for a pack opening video at this time. And then we will do a, so be ready about, ch I mean, just check the channel. After after this, I'll, I'll do a pack opening live stream video uh, at around this time to open up some packs. If you guys have any more packs you want to donate so we can do more during the regular live stream, let me know. But um, we'll do that, open up 100 packs, and then we will work on building decks during the live stream and start recording videos and stuff like that so uh yeah that's pretty dope right now actually 
Uh, let me set up. Let me actually set up the stream. No, I can't set up the stream while I'm streaming. But yeah, that's that's really cool. I'm really excited. So we'll do two streams tomorrow. One in the middle of the day, and one and one during the and one in the middle of the day whenever the packs first open. So be on the lookout for that. And then one near the end of the day, usual time for actual games. Play tool scrapper. What is all I have to play against bad decks to get win streaks? All right, man. I think it's time I ban Lao. Low, whatever his name is. What time is stream tomorrow? Mine is the best trade aura for the pack opening at least. <laughs> the win streaks are fun, bro. I mean, Legacy it's easier to have win streaks in Legacy because nobody plays Legacy. That are, nobody plays good decks in Legacy. Um. Oh, the link doesn't work, bro. Oh, my bad. Oh yeah, I do this. There's so many things. Okay, well, I'll talk to you guys while I organize the rest of my day. Uh, okay, guys, give me a number between 1 and 18. Everybody quickly, because I can choose a box based on this number. Oh, wait a minute. No, hold on, hold on. Give me a number 1, 2, 5, 7, 11, 14, 15, 17, or 18. Pick a number. Because that's going to be the booster box I get. Hey, Joby, you're really late. So, unfortunately... Oh, 7? I like 7. 12 is taken. 4 is taken. Uh, 7 is very common, 18 is not taken, 11 is not taken, but everyone's saying 7, except Jason said 12 and then 7, so I'm going to 7 twice, but so far everyone wants 7, Devin says 5, that's not taken, 9 by Joe, it's a, oh, the 9 is taken, 14 over and over again, which is not taken, but I can't do that, I, like, I have more 7s than anything else, 16 is taken. Eight is taken, so I guess seven's a number because I have two sevens and one of everything else. <laughs> uh, okay, we'll do seven. Seven, please. Let's do this. Get out of you. Get out of you. Feeling seven, bro, bro. All right, well, we got seven. So hopefully you guys didn't screw me over. <laughs> um, thank you for the donations today, guys. Mr. Friday is greatly, greatly, greatly appreciated. Aren't you getting like three boxes? I am. This is one of the boxes that I'm getting. Um, I, I paid for this one. And, or I didn't pay for it. I traded in bulk. And they're telling me, you should, which number would you like? Because they're giving me an option so I don't feel like I'm being screwed over in the end. Uh, but that should be in the stream. Is there anything else I have to talk about? Is there anything else I have to do? Not really. All right. Well, that's it, guys. I'll set up the stream, so be on the lookout for the channel tomorrow morning, afternoonish, where the stream ties and posts a million numbers. <laughs> Regardless, drop a like, subscribe, share all that good jazz, and I will see you guys tomorrow for the official release of Burning Shadows. Peace.